Sure. What's happening though, my boys? Clap it up, man. We clapping it up? I'm waiting for this thing to put his phone down for a second. <laughs> I mean, y'all niggas was just, just, y'all in the just building talking about some shit that I really ain't, I really ain't, I, I ain't. <laughs> that you ain't here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> nigga said no, both. Was an act. Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> no, niggas. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. That's what I said. She Father's Day, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. I don't know where, bro. I said even nigga, if, even if, still, though. niggas is out the way today, bro. It's 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 Father's Day, bro. I don't know where this nigga is at. I done talked to him and everything. <clears throat> What's good, though, my niggas? How y'all feeling today on this beautiful Sunday? I'm chilling, man. Chilling, chilling. Happy Father's Day to you, niggas, man. Yeah, all my, all, all my, uh, all my fathers is out there. All the homies is not here with us today. Happy Father's Day to y'all, man. You doing what y'all doing. Keep on rocking how y'all rocking. You know what I'm saying? I pull from all of my niggas who who is daddies and shit. You know what I'm saying? Happy father. So, yeah, sure. happy father to all you niggas, man. Uh the one that played Father Road to me too. Uh my Uncle Reggie, nigga. Happy father to you too, my nigga. Shout out to my pops, my real pops, cause nigga, clearly I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you niggas, so you know what I'm saying? Fuck you know what I'm saying, niggas when they went through the but yeah, shout out to you. You got a you got a third chance, with baby girl. You know what I'm saying? So take care of that one. Redeem redeem yourself. You feel me? That can be the best thing you can do for me. You know what I'm saying just being being her life the right way. All shit that I already told you. I know you be watching. You told me you be watching. So I'm just saying this shit again so you get your own shout out. But yeah, I feel you on that. Yeah, man. Shout out to everybody, man. Happy Father's Day, man. Yeah, shout out to my nigga Carl. Ma, happy bro. Father's Day, Ma. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got no kid. No, I don't want Carl and just had the baby yeah, right shout before. Shout out the day before bro. Father's Day. You know what, though? Shout out to P. You just, you just made it this year. Shout out to P, though. Had his little baby boy, man. Congrats, my nigga. Welcome. Shout out to my nigga. It's about to get P. real for you now. I ain't clapping shit. It's about to get real for you, P. That's what I said. It's gonna get real for us, like we asked. It's about to get real. He about to be calling niggas. And I told him, I said, "Hey, bro, don't be too, don't be too prideful to call, bro. I know you probably want to talk to your daddy, but listen, a lot of niggas around you got a lot, a lot of experience. <laughs> for real? Listen, for real though, I'm serious. A lot of, a lot of, <clears throat> yeah, a lot of different examples. Come on, man." My niggas need that community to talk to because this shit, this shit ain't, ain't, no, ain't no book on it at all, bro. No. It definitely ain't. You just got to go through it. Yeah, yeah. Just go through the motions and try to figure it out. Oh, it was something else I had. And, and live through shit by the good examples that you've seen from niggas who was raising their kids. Well, I tell niggas, nigga, I pull a little bit of something from it, from every nigga that I know. They got kids, bro. And that's how I put the shit together because, nigga, I tell my the oldest like bro nigga I done fucked up so much y'all don't even know like I gotta tell like it get to the point where like I told you I tell them stories about when I fucking up they probably they don't even be remembering I just be like damn I just felt so bad but nigga didn't even remember <laughs> like nigga but I just had to be like I gotta get that shit off my chest because it was like damn that was some fucked up shit but yeah man ain't no ain't no book to this shit for real for real some of the shit that you be thinking about they don't really be. Thinking about that yeah, shit. Yeah, they don't look at it the same way. But listen, you know it's crazy because some kids do like, or well, on the movies, they be making it seem like the kids <laughs> do. Them niggas don't give a fuck really, though. They don't be. I be thinking that though, like, damn, I wonder if my daughter be like, damn. The first time when I, uh, what made me realize was uh, when I, uh, we wasn't with, we wasn't with Pops when we was growing up and shit. I used to always think like, why, uh, 
why like why the nigga wasn't around. And then like you get older, then you go through the similar situation. You be like, it's because my baby mama moved to a different state. Of course, I can't be in two places at one time. Type shit. No, for sure. <clears throat> so yeah, but yeah, I thought about I think about that shit sometimes too. Or oh, I thought about it before. We all human. Yeah. That's all I say. We, we all human. That's not like a Michael Jackson song. That's a Michael Jackson song? No, it's all human nature. Trash. No, we all human now. We got these expectations just because niggas brought us into this world. But nigga, we all the same. Everybody got their shortcomings. Fuck. That's a fuck. That's why I always say when people be like women or men, they always, always say people thing because nigga. Oh, yeah, you know yeah. Saying? For it's sure. A people thing, it's man. a people thing for sure. I was talking to Baby the other day and I was I was trying to, I was explaining something. But like I just use it as like general. But I was saying, because she was like, men, men can cheat like easier. I'm like, bro. It don't matter who you are, nigga. You can cheat if you want to. Like, you want to easy or not. The ugliest person in the world can go cheat if they really want to. Yeah, it's not being a man or a woman. Now, do niggas probably cheat more than women? Or more likely to cheat more than women? Maybe just because you know how niggas be. But that be, like I said, that's a mindset thing. But yeah. I, 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 I had a conversation similar. Just the other the other day with a person, and it was just like, yo, like the first per the first people I've seen cheat was all women for a long periods of time in my life, and that's why I thought, and that's why I started being the way that I, not to just say this one thing, but that's a, a, a lot of the reason why I started being the way that I was, cause I was like, well, women ain't shit, and this is my own family. I'm looking at it from my mama, my auntie, my cousins, she had my granny, like all these like pl playing like playing niggas, and I was like, bro, I'm never getting done like this. And so I was like, bro, and that's what, once it clicked to me, once it, I found myself, so like all that type of shit, oh, uh, bro, I was, uh, yeah, that's when, that, that's when that nigga was created, like seeing all that shit, and I was like, what? Like, that's said, how that's we, when that nigga was created. Yeah. <laughs> uh, for real, real shit, though. Seeing, uh, seeing my you own. You and me, seeing, nigga. Seeing is believing. <laughs> seeing, I'm like, oh, this, this how women get down, huh? Oh, is okay. believing, for I, real. I will never get done like this. And then I'm just soaking up all all that thing they saying. You know what I'm saying? And then boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I you definitely had that mindset at, at a time. And then I had to grow like shit. If it's going to happen, nigga, it's going to happen. If, even if I think this bitch the most faithful bitch ever. Yeah, because you it, 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 it starts to fuck you up thinking like that because you, you just don't care. Yeah, I know. I, yeah, I'll be trying to. You just don't care. And then at the time, you like, damn, I, I want to have somebody. I no, wanna, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but, I don't want to be. But that mind state still be bad. It's a nigga it's still right Yeah, that's right how it is day. for me, too. I be, I it's try still, not to be. Yeah, like, it'll get less and less for me. Like, I, I don't trust niggas 100%. Like, if y'all my niggas, obviously. But I don't trust niggas like that. But then it's like, you damn near got to. You know what I'm saying? Like, at a, at a, after a certain point. Oh, with certain things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do yeah, everything even in relationship, Yeah, in relationship. More so for relationship. Turns, but it's just like I'm not finna be. I'm not finna be doing the most. <laughs> you feel me? You miss not to myself, that, you know I'm not saying? finna be overthinking everything niggas is doing, moving crazy because I feel like you moving. Like I'd rather just say something to you and <laughs> see what it you is. Because if it ain't what it ain't, then I ain't got. Yeah, yeah. you see what I'm saying? Like, but, fuck it, like yeah. yeah. I was telling, I was like, bro, that's the crazy thing though. Like I didn't see it on a larger scale with. With dudes until I started hanging up having my own friends type shit like like yeah my everybody know my uncle Pat Pat was like nigga the Mac like he was that but that was really it like then we had Uncle EJ I seen but that was really it you know what I'm saying it wasn't on a broader scale than I was seeing the women it was just like this shit was rampant I'm like bro hell nah bro I'm never going I'm ever never ever never going bro and it was. Nigga, for a long time, it was just like, nigga, I don't get no fuck how I do whatever because I know you doing whatever. And it was like. Listen, that's a scary way to be. Forever. For, I mean, yeah. To be worried about something. Somebody yeah. else doing something. And then, but it kept on, it kept on, like I told y'all the story about the, about the, the two girls and 
the, the husband that came home. Like so, this was even now. Now I'm starting to be with my uncles, and now I'm starting to see like not only my family do it, but I'm starting to see other examples outside of the women in my family. So I'm like, damn, we in this damn high rise, yada yada yada. The Duke, you know what I'm saying he got you living nice, and you and you out here living wild. You got us in this man crib. Be like that shit. Big ring on your finger, like fat ring. But you up here fucking off. And it's like, what's that? what's that? But like you said, you gotta trust that trust who you trust. Cause it's like what like I'm giving you the world to that nigga. He put giving her the world. She fucking off in in the house. <laughs> Y'all clearly see he ain't giving her the world. I was about to say it may be I was gonna or say at least to I was her, about to say to her. Yeah, it may be something going on in that situation. You know how that shit go. But y'all seen the video of the tranny uh tranny, the trans man. No. <laughs> no, no, not pause, pause, pause. The I mean, trans I, man I, with his girl. Uh, she cheated on him on vacation. Y'all ain't seen that video? Mm-hmm. That shit been going viral. No, I ain't seen this. Why? I bought this That's bitch it. on vacation. He uh Baltimore nigga. Peek the most. You're you're going <laughs> <girl. laughs> Y'all ain't never seen that shit. No. <laughs> hey, nigga. The way he started, y'all definitely wasn't trying to look for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it ain't it ain't what you think. What it, how it sounded. <laughs> That's the first thing that nigga live with. The trend. It's just a game to play right. with people's feelings. No. Yes, you do, bitch. Yes, you do. Oh, I saw that. Like, the, what's the name? Like, I didn't watch the video though. Why are you playing with me? Why are you playing with me? Comfortable, got real comfortable letting a nigga reply to shit that I recorded off my page. Look how they like, this is disrespectful, bro. Like, people think it's a game to play. <laughs> no, this shit, everybody, y'all, like, so, so, like, the girl cheated on her or something. Like, she was about to cheat on her. She was commenting on niggas, uh, coming back to niggas, sexy and daddy and shit. Like and see, that. that's the one thing that's stupid. Like, if you were the woman and you're a woman that's like a stud or like a trans, like, no disrespect to the letters, but you got to think that you're a woman like a real nigga because you look like a nigga. Like, it, it, it's a lot of stuff wrong with that to, to, for me. And you got a strap on. So, like, you think she don't like a real nigga? Like, and I she act, definitely I, like niggas. And I, I ask these women these things like that, 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 like, been taking straps before and shit like this, and it's like and then get and get real thing. It's like they it's no it's clearly a difference between that and that. It's like certain feelings and veins and shit, like you know some pause, all that type of shit. So like, no nah, real shit. I'm just, nah, just <laughs> I'm, listening. I'm listening. Take the headphones off. It's just, it's just, he went crazy. I'm telling you commentary of what they said. These are not my words. I'm I mean, taking yeah, I, yeah, we know from, we know we know from that. a gist of you feel me. So boom. So it's like yeah. So it's a Clearly, it's a different feeling. It, oh, listen, my my oh. thing is, oh, it's ahead. just wild. It's wild as fuck. Like you got to know that thing. You got to understand that they still don't yearn for that. It's naturally what it's supposed to be. Type shit. What you about to say? I gotta show you something. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> listen. <though. laughs> I was gonna say though about this shit. Like, <coughs> I just don't understand why niggas went on live to do that. It's cause it's, that's a day and age for that shit now, bro. Well, it's cause she was on the internet. Uh, she was doing whatever she was doing on the internet, obviously. <laughs> what the fuck uh, that supposed to be? But see, I'm, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna it, put it. It's the same as the Diddy son shit and all that. You know, people going. I feel embarrassed, so now I feel like I gotta embarrass somebody else. Yeah. Oh, what you doing? What, what you want? Listen. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it might be tough for the boy. I know what you all too. Listen, <laughs> got to see it too. I know what the boy yo. It's 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 it's, it's context behind what you read. Yeah, but it's context behind that as well. <laughs> There's context behind that as well. Listen, I had to read it a couple times before I actually picked up on Talk what she what was being said. said. Yeah. Hey. Come on now. 
I guess not. Nah, it's, it's a motherfucking jelly layer. I'm talking about spice, spiced it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, what that shit's called mesquite. I want the just got some turkey the with the Monterey that. mesquite. <laughs> I just got the turkey with the you know what I mean in it. That's funny. I'm telling you. Damn, hey. But yeah, that, I just feel like that 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 shit was hilarious. I'm like niggas is going on live, crying. It's always something when niggas go on live and cry. It's the thing now. It's the end. It's you know. I'm pretty sure whoever that is, they. In the I just age think bracket. that shit is weird. I seen a video. Uh, the internet is re- we we be on here saying that the internet ain't real life, but it's, that shit is real life no, when you not, grew up no, in not, it. No, it's not. That's, That's what like. you. This is where you have more. If you had most of your reactions on this internet or interactions on this internet, That's your real it's real life. to you. I seen a chick. Oh, oh, um, she sad. said, "It's sad on my life." She said, "Niggas be putting on five chains to come to the crib to watch a movie. Like you weird." I said, "On my life, nigga, pull out a whole fit." And some change to pull up on that bitch at the house. What are we doing, bro? <laughs> Man, nigga, pull up with some sweatpants and a white tee, nigga. <laughs> That's all you need, bro. <laughs> Fuck is you got all um, 30 chains for? Did she meet him like that? I'm the nigga oh, Phil Presta, you know? You met me like this. Now, nah, I can't let you not see me in the... No other way. I don't give a fuck. Well, listen, Especially in the beginning. You know me, I'm in the club with house shoes on. So however you see me is how you see me. Fuck it. And you met me, you met me with some basketball shorts on one day. There's gonna be a time you're gonna see me again in some basketball shorts. If I fuck with you. Oh yeah, I know I nigga. I I go out here looking woofy than a bitch. I don't be giving no fuck. Like Clothes saying. might be clean, but I'll be woofy than a bitch. But I don't. Ten changes is crazy though. Yeah, I'm not going. I'm never. So going you, you to meet my a girl, girl crib. You got you got five chains on. You we go out. You I'm put never on. going to be wearing five chains. All right, ever, I'm just saying. <laughs> you got five chains on. You think you got it? All right, all right. You meet a girl. We'll scale it back. We'll go to you for real. You meet a girl, uh, you got on the you got the hat on this time with the you know how you be dressed sure down. Open. You dressed down. Every time you meet her, you gonna be dressed down? No, I ain't gonna go to her crib like that. Not to just chill. Even if y'all even if y'all like let's go grab some dinner from uh wherever. Like, not even not, not like an upscale restaurant, just like regular restaurant. You can't you ain't gonna I'll go, go to an upscale something? but depending on yeah, I go with some sweats on. I oh, go with okay. whatever I feel like wearing that day, really. Uh, I'm just saying, I thought you was going to be one of them thirsty niggas. Really, more than anything, I'm, I'll be trying to go. If you're going to dress up, I'll dress up. If you're not going to dress up, then I'm not going to dress up. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm a definitely. I'm be. not going to. We're not going to be mismatched. That yeah. look. Oh, he definitely got to crazy. ask a question like, hey, what, <laughs> what you wearing? What you on? Yeah. What you on okay, today, bro? What vibe you got going on? Because yeah. I ain't about to be out here. With sweats Furries on. and shit. Yeah. yeah, you got some sweats on. <laughs> yeah. Mike's like, what? We looking like, hey, y'all together? Right. No, nah, shit. Like, I just met you here. Yeah, like, type shit. Like, we just, outside the door. Like, we don't know each other. <laughs> it's a, it's like, a blind date. I just date. met you today. It's definitely yeah. a blind date, dog. No, dead ass. <laughs> I swear to God. <sighs> niggas got to talk about that. This nigga baby told me a story. She said she went to the. Uh, That's happened to me before. My bad. With a blind date? No, nah, just. Not asking the question and then it's been oh, you've too been tall. Opposite? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. that shit's been crazy. Majority of the time, I'm coming in uh, some 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 chill shit anyway. So once you see me, you gonna be like, I mean, like my chill shit is like it ain't gonna be like you know what I'm saying. Like I'm gonna be able to get in a lot of places with my chill shit if if that makes sense. You know what I'm saying. It ain't gonna be just like, oh shit, he came in this bitch with some Scooby Doo, uh, <laughs> Scooby Doo sweatpants. 
<laughs> nah, nigga, I'm gonna come with some shit. I can move around and get loose in. Nigga, I went to this, this place the other day. Like, not the other day, like last week or so or something like that. And it was after a game, which was crazy because I had a jersey on, but it was kind of late. So I'm like, I know they probably gonna be on some. But that was only because when it's time, but so I brought another shirt and a different hat just in case, you know what I'm saying? But I knew, go up, and it happened. I was like, all right, cool. Came back five minutes later. He was like, damn, bro, like, you must live around the way. I said, no, nah, I just knew this shit was going to happen. <laughs> like, <laughs> the, the Jersey shit is crazy, bro. <laughs> um, but it was after a game, so he's like, bro, he's like, he like, bro, I know you're going to walk in here and see jerseys, but they all was here since early, since the game. I was like, I, I get you, man. I get oh, you. so, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I see. That shit still sounds dumb, though. It sounds dumb. And he was like, Everybody in this bitch with a jersey on. What my jersey yeah. is? It's like once they flip into those certain, like, you know, they bar got hours, the, yeah. club type what hours. You saying? Like, listen, listen. It's we got 50 these niggas time already de- dedicated in this. for this. It's 50 time, niggas baby. in there with jerseys on. Yeah. yeah. Bro, I'm telling you, it was. You know it was motherfucking Mavericks. Especially crazy. if it's a, yeah, if it's it a was Dallas Mavis game. crazy in there. Bro, the whole, the whole it was spot Mavis jersey. crazy. I swear to God. It was crazy, but it, yeah. He and he said he's like, bro, I know as soon as you go in here, you're gonna see all these jerseys, but I gotta say this. Just like that. Like, That's so stupid though. And I could tell, like, you know what I'm saying? The, the other dude behind him, like a manager. What, is, what is the and shit like that? What is the thing with jerseys? What's the like jersey? athletic wear. Yeah. So what 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 that mean? No athletic wear after a certain time. They trying to have, have a certain aesthetic yeah. to the to the spot, man. At a certain time, bro, I will go in the most upscale place with a jersey on, if I wanted to. Not a basketball jersey, though. I'll probably wear like a baseball jersey. But, but if there's a place where they niggas. wouldn't allow it, then. I mean, yeah, if they ain't allowed, they ain't allowed. I'm just saying. I know. I'm just saying. Like, my whole thing is like, bro, let niggas be how they want to be. You feel what I'm saying? Like, the fuck, I don't gotta. If bro want to come, if if I got a restaurant, it's a five star restaurant, bro. We don't have a dress code. Just don't come in. This, well, you can't come in this bitch with no fucking holes and shit. All then you damn near titties and all that shit out, but. Well, that's your aesthetic right there. Yeah. No, I'm saying if it's age or probably it's probably only kids in there, my nigga. I'm saying if it's if it's not no matter how you put it, brother. Yeah. That's an aesthetic. <laughs> I'm saying it's just, it's, it's, it's just gonna be age appropriate. That's all. Just don't come in here naked because we got kids in here. But like, bro, if you have something on that shows skin, I'm not gonna be like, no, nah, just don't have your ass and your titties out. Or don't wear the see through shit where your nipples showing. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't do that. It's kids here. No matter how you like to uh, dress up your salad, that's the call. Yeah. <laughs> the put state. a jersey on. I'm just saying the jersey is crazy. The jersey situation is crazy. No, I agree. No, I agree. No, I definitely agree. Ma, are you sleepy? You sleepy? I'm, I'm Listen, this, this nigga ain't played. He ain't been athletic in so long that a couple of games of catch. volleyball got him fucked up. You can't catch at all. You just gotta be athletic more often than what you is. You won't be so hurt. Yeah, nigga, oh, one, yeah, once a year ain't gonna cut it. <laughs> Bro, so I played volleyball, nigga, back in 2020. It's 2024. Damn, nigga. Four years ago, that nigga, nigga you been is happy. fucked off. Nigga, I ain't played Sam Volleyball. And that was five years ago. 2019, almost. <laughs> That's why you over there going crazy. Loki, I ain't played Sam Volley. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Never mind. Bro, nigga, they used to, they used to have uh, parties at Lake Louisville. I, I, used be, nigga, I used to be up there. <laughs> nigga, them motherfuckers used to be. It still be. Every court, nigga, still was. Still be. People. To my 11, 12 at night. Yeah. Right now, still. Yeah. yeah. I'm telling you. Yeah, it used to be lit outside. Yeah, you wasn't here at the time. I used to, I used to live so close to there. I used to walk to that hole. Oh. Uh, when I first when I first came out here, I used to literally uh where Lake Louisville is, 
on uh, the main street on El Dorado, mm-hmm. where that fire station was down that street. Oh, right by the gym. Come on, man. Yeah, that's where I used to, I used I used to, to walk, hoop there. I used to walk to that gym. When I first got into Texas, that's where we was hooping at. I used to walk to walk to that hoe. What's that, that shit little called? Gla- that little glass on. That gym was smooth, though. It was smooth. That gym was smooth. Was Tucked off, too. Tucked no. away. Not too many people knew about no, it. Oh my life, it was low key as <laughs> shit. That shit was low key as yeah, shit. I saw the guy. That's the first time I met bro. I told you I always I used to uh like not not I don't say train, but I used to hoot with him and like before his daddy should get that because oh 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 uh, RJ yeah, yeah, it makes yeah. sense yeah it do make sense. He used to be there every day. I used to be there with him all the time. What the god? It makes sense. We went up there. Some niggas up there thought they was cold as fuck. And this was this was his eighth grade year. This wasn't even like you talking been, about Hampton. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He went to he went right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The little M. So I was at nigga, all the games, nigga. From because his, his freshman year, he was on varsity. I was at all them games, nigga. And my uh my little homie, he was on the sophomore team, so they like still all hung out together. And he was all like, all in that little friend group. Mm. Hell yeah. Y'all want to go to basketball next since y'all talking about since basketball? Since we already talking about it. You know what I mean? Who you see? It's only fitting. That's T-Step. You want to go to the finals? Yeah, where else we going? How many things up there? I put something up there about y'all. Oh, yeah. Oh, why? Who did that? You did that? Mm-hmm. Oh, we can do the finals because I don't even know what that means. That's funny. <laughs> What about y'all said about the fun? Y'all said, but it, nigga, it's over with for these niggas. I don't care how many more games they win. It's over. I told niggas that they're going to give them a game in Dallas because they don't want to win in Dallas, bro. They beat their ass three times, and they was like, oh, yeah, we can really just. It's like a cat with a toy. Like, they just. They might, Dallas you know might get saying? one more. They don't win it. But I feel like they going, I feel like they want to win in Boston. I mean, yeah, yeah, they probably play a little bit harder in Boston for sure. But I feel, I feel like, like Dallas could get one more. Dallas, Dallas got a don't to play now, bro. Defense, bro. Them niggas don't been. play defense. And it's not Luca fault. You was blaming Luca. It is Luca fault. No, it's not Luca fault. It's a lot. Defense is more than Kawhi Leonard. Kawhi Leonard is just the best. It defender. ain't. I. Ain't, it ain't just the on ball defense for me though. If you get beat, nigga, you can't just stand there. But that's what they whole team. You got to rotate, nigga. If you get beat, somebody going to step up. You got to rotate to the next man. Gotta, he don't do that. He do you, just stand you there. I'll be watching it. Uh, I'll be watching it. Yeah. Them niggas don't. Them niggas, the way they play they defense. They're a bad defensive team, period. Yeah, they a bad defensive team. And then a lot of times they don't switch. Uh-uh. You got they big. They, they bigs to play block to block or slightly high post. They're not gonna come outside the stretch like that because once you pull them out, that's their rim protector. Now they fucked. Like, and don't let them be in foul trouble. Don't let Lavdi or Gafford be in foul trouble because it's really over with. Yeah, they don't. They don't switch. They don't. They don't move. It's just niggas, yeah, not rotating. And then Luca. No. Nah, then you got. They guard. Yeah, you can say. Oh, you can Luka, say Luca don't Kyrie, play defense. Hardy. Don't let them. Yeah, play yeah, defense. and then Kyrie six one like. I'm just, I'm just being funny, but like he a little nigga, like it don't matter, like it's, it's, his niggas head just gotta rotate, it's just smart niggas get beat and just get caught looking, just staring. But yeah, but I'm saying that to say again, they play like they playing pickup. That's how what they play. Like, niggas just that is what they play. <laughs> Them niggas. Oh, you know, I got what, beat. Whatever. Oh, no, uh, nigga, move, rotate. This nigga gonna step up. Find somebody to go guard. Whatever schemes they have. It's pickup schemes. It's it's trash schemes. And Luca got the ball too much in his hand, or Luca has to have the ball too much in his hands, so he he can't even exert himself on defense that much, cause he gotta be like, nigga. He gotta be Luca. If Kyrie bring the ball down the court every possession, Dallas is going to lose. It's possessions where we all right, Kyrie, go ahead do your thing. You got to get four or five of these off. But majority of the possessions start off uh, with Luka like, for a reason. He got Then you ball. asking this nigga to guard. Or that's just like I said with the Timberwolves. He guarding Tatum and Brown. That's terrible, bro. Put this nigga on the ball, Drew dude. or uh, Derek White. Well, he don't. He don't play good off ball defense though. 
still. He get caught staring. If he, if it's, he a bunch, ball, it's a bunch of footage worse. of this nigga even being off ball and just getting caught looking at whoever got the ball. Yeah, Somebody I mean, cut, he yeah, loses yeah, he man or whatever defense, the fuck. But that's just, like I said, that's just, that's the Dallas Mavericks. Anyway, it's the Dallas Mavericks Association for letting them niggas play defense like that. <laughs> All they got to do is, hey, bro, you going to have to slide your ass right here, nigga. He got the ability. Niggas was saying, Luca, lock it up. Hell no, nah, bro. He stepped up his defense a little bit. He did. But, mm-hmm. like, the attention span. I said, bro, no, bro. He was locking up a little bit. Well, no, nah, crazy defense is crazy. He was he was a certain this a little bit more. He was playing better. Yeah, he was but, a certain I mean, a little more. But that stopped. It quick. don't take... Uh, it didn't take much to, to get better to than yeah, what yeah, he... Yeah, yeah, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> to get better than what it was. <laughs> Yo, dude, I hope my nigga Drew get this. Uh, I meant to wear the holiday jersey too, but I hope my nigga Drew get this dub tomorrow. I'm about to close it out in Boston, bro. You know what I'm saying? Let my nigga get another ring. This nigga got to rest the whole fourth quarter. <laughs> you know, Patrick McCall is the next guard under Steph with the most rings. How many Steph's? Uh, how many? I mean, that's Who? active. That's active right now. Patrick Who? McCall. I think you don't even know. Who my life? He used to play for the Warriors. I'm about to say, then he's play for the Warriors. I'm about to say, that's the. That's, he got three. He got two. That's the nigga with from. Uh, that's the nigga from. Guard Love or point guard? I think point guard. I think guard, though. Who a who, two guard that got more rings in him? Oh, well, Clay, huh? Well, what is Clay? Clay had two. Yeah. He had two on paper. Well, yeah, we told you, I'm guessing they said point guard then. I said, hell no. Nah. That nigga Patrick McCall, three rings up on these fuck niggas. He gonna have to sell them after a while. Damn. <laughs> I hope his life doesn't go that bad. I ain't saying his life gonna go that bad, but I'm saying. Why you gotta sell him dead? All right. Y'all know that NBA money ain't that long. That's why I said I hope y'all niggas didn't know who y'all. y'all, y'all I said I Patrick McCall. Was. <laughs> well, you did, but I said Patrick McCall. Niggas say who? Yeah, I don't know. Who that I was is. just seeing where you was going with the story. I like. don't know that deep on the bench on no team but the Lakers. We, we, I knew him because I used to be like, hey, he got, I it, might know a couple niggas. It sounded like the nigga from what's the name from Loving Basketball last name. So I was like, hey, oh, McCall, yeah, Quincy like, McCall. It's this nigga. He wanted the McCalls. That's hilarious. He wanted the McCalls. Fake how. When I seen it, I was like, oh shit, he one of them calls. Oh, right, listen. Uh, R.I.P. to Jerry West. You see, they said that nigga checked out. I ain't <laughs> he said he, they say he he checked out before he got a chance to see Boston win another ring. He said, no, nah, I ain't going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that is hell. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> Bro, niggas be saying anything, anything on the net, bro. That is hell, bro. Nigga was 86 years old. It was about, you know what I'm saying? That's a he good life. I'm out of here. Fuck all that. He said it's getting too close for Fuck them. Fuck all that Boston Celtics <laughs> shit. That, that nigga understood. Fuck all that Boston Celtics. He seen Dallas and he was like, nah, I'm hell nah. my muffin, nigga. I'm hungry. I just want you to know. You know the muffin, man? <laughs> It's me. So who, yeah. who got the who got who y'all think gonna win the finals MVP? JT. I mean uh JB. Drew. Listen. JB. If he win the, if you got him a good game the next game, Who's I could see it happening. Who's Drew. A, come on now. He's he make big play happening. after big play for these whole ass niggas. He ain't gonna get it though. They gonna give it to us. Take them more uh they JB, bro. Yeah, they gonna give it to him. But Drew, bro. oh my mom, I'm watching him. That nigga really be everywhere, bro. Still. Everywhere. Like real life. Guarding everybody, bro. He it's definitely crazy. ever on the flow. But I I don't know. I for one I don't see and they ain't giving to the losing team. They ain't did that, you know what I'm saying? But J B impact has been bigger than J T impact. Bro, is is uh Porzingis playing right now? He didn't play. He only played one game, I think. Yeah, they say they saying Same later game. on in the series, but well, he gonna have this ring. Don't even count. 
I'm gonna dunk. Hmm? Shit, they won game one because of him for real, for real. Mm. Man, well, nigga, ain't we, play. nigga, I'm part of the reason we got this far the too. first seed too, nigga. We won sixty some games. It ain't like I miss. I don't know how many games he played, but he played a lot of games this year. Mm. They were saying he still can come back and play at the end, of, like and sometime in the series. Nigga, he better sh- that shit his ass down. This should it should be over right tomorrow. <laughs> nigga, give me that shot. Fuck around, fuck around, come back and do what KD did. I'm playing tomorrow. Give me that shot, coach. <laughs> Mm-hmm. No, no, he did miss quite a few games. He, he did what? He played 57 games. Come on now. <clears throat> I knew that nigga didn't play no 60. <laughs> Three away. Mm. Shit's crazy. No. Five, but yeah, they probably, five, gonna give, they probably gonna give it to JT just because the narrative. He said JT. He got to have a good game the next game. He like got to. Outstanding. outstanding he didn't have no good game. All the last two games, he had a good game. No, I'm saying, like, they games, all the games that he had, good games, Brown had a good game, too. Brown ain't had a bad game. JT had a bad game. Yeah. The first, and yeah, even that, that second game where Jason Tatum had, like, 16, but he had, like, 11, 12 rebounds. But Jalen Brown had like thirty something. Yeah, <laughs> like ten who, assists. Who uh, who got the uh, Western Conference, the Eastern Conference? Jalen Brown did. Oh, he been frying niggas up in the playoffs. You, you got that shit in your beard, nigga. I, don't I was gonna say. Uh, <laughs> I seen some whole got, ass shit. Uh, Tatum said. Oh, he ain't here. You, you got that. Oh, right. oh. <laughs> I'm trying to see where it should up. I heard some whole ass shit. Tatum said, uh, I mean, it's it, it, it's a, it's the right mindset, but it's the LeBron mindset. What? He was like, yeah, bro. I realized that if it ain't on me and I got to pass the ball a little more in order to get the dub, I'm cool with that. I ain't got to score all the points. Like, yeah, yeah, I understand that shit, but like, What yeah, you, what are you supposed to say? Is that not when you get asked the question? I gotta play better. Uh-oh. That's all you gotta say. I'm happy that we doing good. I gotta play better. Fuck y'all niggas scoring thirty. Yeah, school scored thirty, nigga, and I had five. I had ten assists. He had. Nigga, I need twenty some, twenty five, fifteen, seventeen. But we won. So what? I knew it to listen. This nigga, we at the gym. G G G. So we what? at the gym. There you go. I, was, I knew you was gonna bring this up because <laughs> I got something to say too. We at the gym. G. <laughs> this nigga get the. I ball. hope you tell the whole story though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell the whole story. No, dude. what happened? Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I don't remember what happened before. So you go ahead. To... I see where you started. This. this nigga get the rebound. He get the rebound. He go up, miss. I want him like four times. But before four this. Four times. Listen, oh, school, just, what was the score? I don't remember. Before, we was down nine nothing. Oh, like, yeah, we was. <laughs> I brought us back yeah. after that. Look, 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 look. So I'm like. I knew he was going to say that. Just let us go down nine nothing. He going to say these niggas. They man was scoring the most. Bro, and your man. No, what's the name? No, that was Brown. Brown. Oh, yeah, yeah. He made like. The game he talking about. He made like three or four. He made four threes, bro. I'm like, you know what? This weak ass nigga scored. I was like, what the fuck? So it wasn't my fault. But he did. Go crazy. He did go in a little nothing. run. It ain't like I was missing. But listen, G, he's saying that like I didn't do the same thing. We went down again, and I had to score like 15 points damn there in the, in the row. <laughs> oh, my mom nigga kept giving me the ball. I kept scoring that motherfucker. But yeah, he right. He is right. But this nigga, get, he missed the ball. All three of these niggas collapsed on him. He missed that bitch three times. Oh, nigga, scoop. Come on, nigga. <laughs> he put that bitch back up with one hand. The, I, I wouldn't even been mad, bro, if the nigga went up again. The nigga went up with one hand, though. I just, I tipped. He grabbed that bitch yeah. and tried to tip it back instead of giving me the ball to lay it up. I was mad as a bitch. I'll jump these niggas. You could have just 
hit it to me, I would have just laid that shit up. I hated this nigga for that shit. But we won the next couple games, so I wasn't even Nigga, we was down 9 nothing. I'm we like, definitely was down no. nothing. We won the game. We won that game, though, didn't we? No, we didn't. Oh. We came back. We tied it up. They ain't no money. But, yeah. That nigga had me mad as fuck. Nigga missing every time. <clears throat> the heat. Oh, I ain't no way. <laughs> then brown ass airballing. Shout out my nigga B, man. Be over here airballing because he ain't got no legs. Nigga probably been in some coochie the whole week. <laughs> <laughs> but we won. We definitely <laughs> busting that. <laughs> you no, know I'll go with y'all niggas being that woo woo. Being that y'all, I mean, and that wooty woop. I knew he was going to bring that up, though. How you know that? Because you was mad. <laughs> Immediately after the game, he was mad. Because I think we lost right we after lost. I, I was doing that. I think they had 11 or whatever, whatever game point was. After I missed that, and then they got the rebound. And they won right after that. That nigga said he was going crazy. He did score plenty of points on that game in the world. I ain't going to lie. But it ain't like I was missing. I just was giving up. We was down. No, nah, no. In my mind, I'm like, we only down. No, nah, no, because. This lame ass nigga just making shots he don't make. Like, bro was hitting them. Yeah, he was knocking them bitches down. <laughs> like, ain't no way this nigga hitting this shit, bro. Go, like, nigga, we down nine. No. Scoop, 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 scoop. Hey, it's the, I ain't gonna lie though. My nigga did go crash. And some niggas was trying to double team his nigga. He wrapped their ass. <laughs> that nigga almost touched the ground. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> that nigga said, I look like you, did I? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe my nigga rapped the fuck out them niggas like that. I thought they was going to run into each other, G. Scoop. <laughs> oh, my soul. I, was, I think that was for game, damn near. It was. I said, damn. Look at did you like that for the highlight. <laughs> What's the y'all mean shit that we you speaking about? Man, shout out to my little nigga Stewie, man. Making that big ass white boy fall. Oh, yeah, he went crazy. He went crazy. The boy had a little stumble stutter. <coughs> Bro, boom. <laughs> Cash that yeah, bitch right. Yeah, that that right. looked good to me. <laughs> that shit looked good. A little to nigga stew you, man. He said, Uncle, you see me? I said, Yeah, hey, yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> nigga, went shit. Crazy. You went crazy. That nigga started tumbling down. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> I'm damn. I was like, God damn. He's a big ass white big boy. Big ass too. white boy. No disrespect. No, yeah, but hey, get your feet work together, young man. What you about to say though? I, and I didn't say what I wanted to say last week about Gilbert and my ass, but we good though. Come on. What you talking about? What the AI shit? No, we can talk about that too if you want. It, it wasn't that important. Like, niggas just be saying stupid shit. What you was about to say though? Oh, the y'all mean thing. I was going, I know we went, I know we're not going to talk about what's the name. But uh, I thought about it. He said, "What's the name?" Yeah, 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 yeah. I, see, I, see, yeah. I like, just thought about. I just thought about how how it went when Yao Ming came in the league, and it just it was it's kind of similar to me. Because well, you know, Yao Ming made the All Star game his rookie year. Started, nigga averaged twelve points or some shit. But it, that's, that's that voting <laughs> process too, because when you got a whole fucking country, oh, yeah, they was voting then. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on now, now I act like you funny. But, I'm just saying that the way the league handled that then, that yeah. was part of them trying to expand the league, get more revenue. And exactly. Obviously, when you can, it when you worked. Can, when you can vote in and you got a whole country that got the most people in your, co- in your country, <laughs> yeah, you can it. call in, bro. You How many minutes you had? Made it. You got some more mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, you made it. You made it. And then he was like, the big thing is it was like, this big dude can shoot. And then it wasn't like people were was saying that he was trash. And even Shaq was saying he was a hard somebody hard for him to stick because that nigga was just good. He was, first day was calling bro try. It was I mean once he got used to the game, the, the physicality of the game. Yeah, it, nigga, when Shaq step you, nigga, you I ain't trying to hit nothing after that. Yeah, because he did after that league after that year. He I think he, it was a couple of them years where he was you know MVP finalist. Yeah, y'all so was smooth, he did. Though. But that's not what she gonna be. Well, I'm I'm saying it to say that the league. The nigga didn't show nothing. He, we didn't see nothing. We ain't show nothing. But they put him on this thing just to try to, you know, expand. get more. Yeah, expand the league. 
For sure. It worked. Yeah. So it's gonna work for this then. Huh? I don't know. I just no, think that's the way it should be handled. White dude, uh, that that video I sent, that coach, mm-hmm. he said the most accurate shit. Oh, you that was you UConn old coach, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you said the most accurate shit. I was like, yeah, this I seen that shit like it, I seen a post on it, yeah, like yeah, like a week ago, yeah, before they but I was like, yeah, right on the nail in the coffin. I'm talking about nigga. I'm talking. Yeah, he hit that. I bitch. can't remember what he said exactly. I watched it. I can't remember what he said. Well, he was just basically saying like. She started a lot of shit that she be doing. And then niggas that don't watch basketball is the reason why. She getting like hype. That. Yeah, she getting the hype because they like, not really y'all watching don't these even games. watch basketball. Y'all out here saying she the greatest basketball player. And don't watch it. It's motherfuckers. He say, nigga, I coach some of the best WNBA players ever. Ever. <laughs> like nigga, what the fuck, nigga? This girl is not nowhere near that right. Who now. won that game yesterday? I think they lost. They said, "Oh, they, they, uh, yeah, they uh, lost." They said she got locked up too. No, I'm talking about. Uh, I don't know. I ain't talking about the fever. I'm talking about. Uh, oh shit! I thought you were talking about Kayla. I the said, Aces and Liberty. They played. They, played uh, they just lost. They, they lost. Good. They lost by like three or something. They played some. T- what's the What's the team with the orange jerseys? The shorty had like twenty something, and Kayla had ten. Mm. Locked her up. I'm like, oh, well. Yeah. You know, I think that was a couple of days ago you talking about. No, mm-hmm. you know, I be just yeah. seeing memes be popping up. So I just see it when I see the meme. I don't be yeah, no, yesterday I see Liberty shit. won. Yeah. yeah, Liberty won yesterday. I seen that. So I was like, damn. Who play for, that's where uh, my girl played for, yeah. This nigga hilarious. Angel. No, Angel played for the Sky. Angel played for Chicago. Damn. Brianna Stewart played on Liberty. Brianna Stewart. <clears throat> That's all I be saying. I be trying. Angel played with a bit with the uh, big center from South Carolina, the, the mm-hmm. Puerto Rican shit. And my pops was telling me about the, the chick that was rookie the, last year on uh, on the Fever. That's called uh, that, that big girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You talking about she got the she I got can't the think her last yeah. name Boston. Her last name Boston. Aaliyah Boston, I think. Yeah, she she yeah. she supposed to be nice. Yeah. But they've been sucking. That's how they keep on getting the first picks, though. I guess she had a good game a couple 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 games ago or whatever. Mm-hmm. And they won. They got her, that's when they got her to speak on, on what's her name. But saying how good ah. she was and how she was, yada, yada, yada. But I don't know. We going to still see, bro. Our nigga need an Epsom salt bath. <laughs> 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 that nigga need an Epsom salt bath. That's some Ben Gay. That's some. That's some he already been. <laughs> you already are on what? Huh? Oh, you can hear me? Huh? This nigga here. <laughs> the beverage just came. Yeah, I'm the prison. Oh, they, they went cold. They cold. Where the fuck you get them from? Let me go ahead and get one, man. What 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 is it? Y'all got you got ice? Mm-hmm. It's ice in the freezer. Yeah. Just step spike on it. All right. What y'all doing? We can go ahead and grab a little drink. I just wanted to see if y'all was gonna get up before me. <laughs> what you wanna say about tank? Cause you know I ain't really got that much commentary about tank. I wish I like boxing more than I like boxing. I, I, uh, I seen what I seen. It was just yeah. I like it. I just won't. I just ain't trying to pay to watch it and that nigga get knocked out in the first round. That's gonna piss me off. I mean, niggas ain't them. Niggas, <laughs> niggas, niggas, niggas not Mike Tyson. Niggas, no more. that shit ain't happening no more. If I, that happened, that's that, gonna piss that me shit off. Not, that shit not happening. No Otherwise, more. I would. I would do. It. I well, I guess even. I guess it'd probably be a better ch- or less of a chance in. You know what? What weight class they in? Stream East. The lower. I don't know which one they in. 135. So what's that? What's Welter, that light, yeah, light, yeah. light heavyweight. Damn, what's featherweight? Featherweight, like 120 something. That's what I thought. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know what they was. I just knew they was in there. Oh, they fought, yeah, they fought at 135. I could be in the featherweight yeah. class. No, nigga. No, oh, man. 120? Oh, <laughs> shit. You <laughs> damn near heavyweight, you nigga. What you said, away, you, <laughs> you were like, you were like, if you want seventy, one eighty, you damn near heavyweight. Yeah, you damn near heavyweight. <laughs> oh, what? Yeah, nigga. <laughs> damn. I ain't 
you would have to you would have to you would have to fight at you can walk around one seventy, but you have to fight at like one forty five if you want to fight like you know what I'm saying? Lower class type shit. Like the heart you not I ain't even losing the Charlo that. twins, they they walk around weight like one ninety. You know what I'm saying? But they fight at one well, one fight at one forty five and then one fight. That's at, what they do be losing that much? Damn. Bro, How the fuck you dropping, losing bro. that much weight that fast? I can't be dying. Be dropping. But then that's why we having that's so many rules in, in, in boxing because you got them rehydration clauses and shit like where you can't go back up to your regular walking weight day of the fight, but long as you at the weigh in, you supposed to be that weight. But and then they say you can sometimes get rehydration clauses where you can go to back to a certain weight, but not your walk around weight because you gonna clearly have more power at with this much more weight on you type shit. But that should get that should get that should get tricky. Hmm. But it was just the fact that Buddy was talking so much shit And he was just like Yeah I've been watching Yada 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 I've been doing this Doing that You know I'm watching All the damn Showtime shits And I'm just watching them Watching them Watching them I know you gotta sell a fight And whatever But it's like bruh At a certain time You ain't get this man No props Like you ain't get this man No props for just Knocking niggas out You just had shit To talk about yourself And it's like bruh Like you gotta understand You get in this ring With a motherfucking monster I'm like this nigga Tank is a monster bruh Oh, he knocked him out. What? How many rounds? Four to eight for eighth round. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But that's the thing. People saying Martin got the first three rounds, but look at all Tank. Tank liked to get hit the first three rounds because he liked. He, I was gonna say that's what I was gonna say. He like I know that nigga know how to take a punch. Yeah, and, he, like he, he, and then he <laughs> liked he liked to get hit. Like he don't tee up until he got hit. For until he started getting hit. When he get hit, and that's when he started boxing. That's exactly what happened. After that third round, he started walking his ass down. You could tell he was about to finish him, and he was trying to just set up the shots because he's the way he was moving them. He just check, he walking down the whole time, but he placing his feet and moving them where he want to. If it's like a game, he like moved them into the corners every time he falling for it. By the fourth fifth round, nigga Martin threw all his punches where he can't, he can't really throw none. He's just trying to wrap up all the time, wrap up, wrap up, nigga six six seven round. My nigga tank to start popping his head. Pow, pow. One jab. Hit, pow, pow. Pow, pow. Like it's tagging him. Man, by that eighth round, that nigga got him to that corner, hit him with an overhand hook. Boom. Motherfucker tuck. Nigga came back with a motherfucker. My nigga dodge one time, came back with a motherfucking uppercut. Boom. Nigga hit the ropes. That nigga blinked and was like, he said, like, he said, like, oh shit. Like when he, like, you can see it in his face. And he was just like, <laughs> Damn, that one hurt. And as he like came to his senses and said, "Damn, that hurt." The motherfucker left came again. Boom, nigga just fell. <laughs> Head hit the ground. I said, "Oh yeah, it's over with for this nigga, nigga." Night, night. You talked all that shit, nigga. Got your ass knocked out. He said, "I ain't never getting knocked out. It's gonna go to round if it go anything. They gonna have to decide now, nah, but." That's the craziest part when niggas be talking that crazy. You be talking the way crazy, bro. Out. Talking crazy, man. I'll be a boxer. I'm never gonna. I'm gonna talk my shit, but I ain't gonna talk too crazy till you got the way in. Just in case you knock me off, folks. <laughs> Today might be your day, bro. That man was 20, what, 28 and 0? Dang. First loss. That nigga, that nigga, Tank out here handing out niggas' first losses. Like, <laughs> plenty niggas' first losses coming by Tank. <laughs> nigga, the fuck you talking about? <laughs> Goofy Mugs, Lomachenko, you he coming Damn, for you next. Bro. And I hope he bust your ass two paws. He's not gonna fight Shakur because that nigga don't do shit but run. I hate talking about other black niggas, but that nigga don't do shit but run, so eh, that's not gonna be a good fight. You're not gonna get paid like that, Shakur. You gotta learn a different fighting technique. He ain't gonna fight when he gonna fight Earl. I don't Earl don't want that smoke. <laughs> Earl beat Earl beat Shakur, right? Didn't he? Earl beat Shakur, yeah. but Earl got his ass beat by Terrence. Hmm. And hey, and I know you niggas and and Dallas love that nigga Earl. I feel it. I understand. You know what I'm saying? But he got his yeah, ass I beat. Remember niggas was crying about that. He got his ass beat. He got his ass toe off like bad. Niggas was really crying. Bad. About that I ain't know who to go for, so I called my uncle. My uncle was like, man. You ain't seen no uh, Terrence fights? I'm like, man, not too many. So I go look at like a couple of them before, and I call them back like, hey, I got, I got this nigga Terrence. Bro, I'm sitting in a house full of Dallas niggas with the niggas from the football team, and I'm the only nigga there going for Terrence, bro. Boop that nigga up. Boop that nigga up, bro. <laughs> Toe that nigga up. I said, look at y'all, savior. 
<laughs> Look at them on the mat. <laughs> they mad as hell. <laughs> It's all, G, get your ass out. You gotta go. I'm just saying, bro. I'm saying, you get beat on, getting beat nigga. on, bro. Get this shit beat on. <laughs> get it. Dude, listen, the, the thing that's making so bad is that nigga Martin trains at that nigga. Uh, he trains at what's the name, Jim? He's down here training for that whole fight. Who? The Martin nigga. Ugh. He trained with. Uh, him from here that from there from Earl, Shakur, from Earl oh. he trained at Earl Jim Earl trainer is his trainer Girl, no, he was down here to hold in Dallas the whole time training before that fight so you see they need a new trainer hey hey <laughs> <laughs> he just got just trainer of the year too trainer. right before Earl lost he had got trainer of the year and then Earl lost, and then the crazy thing when 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 uh, the tank beat Ryan, Ryan left all his whole staff that Oscar De La Hoya and them, and then he came down to Dallas. Now he trained with with them same dudes. Hmm. Oh Ryan, and he trying to get his rematch so with Ryan Tank. Ryan just got the most. Ryan just most popular on the internet. <laughs> like he can box. Don't get me wrong, but he ain't got shit for Tank. I mean, yeah, yeah, not for tank, not for tank. I'm saying out of them niggas. I, 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 I take Ryan to beat Earl though. I would like to see Tank and Tank and Terrence fight though. That's the fight I want to see. All these other niggas, Tank gonna beat them all. Terrence gonna beat them all. But until them so two who niggas, gonna fight, go, who gonna fight next? Tank L- Lomachico. He undefeated too, or no? Yeah. Bro, trying to give out everybody an L. Mm-hmm. Well, I, I I get that to him. Then he fight niggas that's undefeated. He ain't people love Lo, and Lomo Chico loved. Like everybody loved Lomo. That's yeah. another reason why I ain't watch boxing. Niggas wasn't fighting the people that they were supposed to be fighting. Yeah. Even like when uh, in the heavyweight, what was the big nigga name? The black uh, man. Yeah. I don't think he wasn't American though. He was black, but he, I don't think he was American. Uh, the brown skinned nigga. Yeah. Uh, from, uh, I know you're talking about. Uh, like Adrian. Uh, no, not Adrian. What's his name? It's A. It's, it started with A. Though. It started with A, yeah. Because he's from like France or some shit. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. He won't fight nobody. But he nobody. wasn't fighting nobody. He yeah. won't fight But he's knocking them niggas out. As, yeah. Then as soon as he fought, who did he fought? Andy, uh, Andy Ruiz and got his ass beat. Beat the fuck up. By the Mexican with a belly. And I think that was right Yeah, right before he was supposed to have fight uh, uh, Tyson. Yeah. Got his ass beat. Got his ass beat. A mess with a belly, bro. Knocked out. Not even. Not even lost in decision. He got knocked out. Like KO. But yeah, that's why I I don't really watch it because the niggas that's supposed to fight don't never fight. It's crazy that Andy made a drop after that because you see like, he tell the truth like I mean I, after that win after I won that I got drunk and shit came back to the next fight I was uh, fucked up out of shape out of weight mm-hmm. but he just knocked somebody else out another big boxer like two weeks ago mm-hmm. same dude he just knocked somebody else out came back he took it more serious came back and, and laid somebody else out another black dude <laughs> laid him out though. what's the name just got knocked out a couple weeks ago didn't he or like a week ago Tyson or not Tyson uh, I said they fight got postponed to November what's the big dark skin nigga no, you talking about Wilder. Wilder. Yeah, yeah Wilder. Yeah, Wilder, Wilder got shit, yeah. yeah, he got this shit. And he got knocked out again, bro. It's like, God damn. And I was rooting for him, too, because I'm like, bro, you you took an L against a man who keep beating you. You know what I'm saying? And it took a bad L. Niggas had you coming back for this last one, and you just didn't look good. That, you really let people know that you only got, like, one punch. You only got one style. And if people counter you just that, got all that power. And you got all that power. That's all you got to do is behind that, that one hand. You got, <laughs> and it's only that one hand. You avoid that one hand, that all the power from that one hand, then you good. And if it's somebody that can really box, you're going to beat them every time. So for a long time, niggas didn't understand that. And, he, and they was getting caught with that one mm-hmm. hand. And if you get caught with it, it's night night. Like, it's night night. Like, I mean, but Tyson, a good the, boxer, and he even got caught with it. Though. But he, he got, just up. got up. That's the only nigga that ever got up. So when he got up, that's like seeing a dead arise. Like, oh my god, my 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 shit didn't work. So after that, you kind of damn near shaking your. You gave your everything. The that one that the one that cleaned period, niggas up. Crazy. That nigga bro. got up, and then it was a draw, and then came back, and then beat his ass, dropped him, dropped him twice. Matter of fact. Said, oh, it was sad you too. Out, nigga. I done figured out your super. I move. think he just lost recently too, didn't he? Like a Tyson. month ago or something like. Yeah, Fury just lost. 
Yeah. Uh, fuck boxing. Man, I'll watch it, but and I'll be knowing a little bit. My pops into it. A lot of the shit that I'm not into in sports, I'm gonna know about it anyway. Cause my dad, he watch everything. Yeah, Golf. My uncle don't watch everything. boxing, bro. Like I fuck with boxing, but that's it. Cause them niggas gonna fuck with. Every time I needed like a decision, I call my uncle Floyd, man, and he be knowing. But no, see, listen, nephew, this is why. Go back and watch this fight. Go back and watch this fight. He told me about Benavidez, the nigga who fought right up under, uh, right up under tanking them. Mexican dude. That nigga said, I just love everything about boxing. I love getting hit. I don't care. I'm like, oh, when you got niggas like that, the Mexicans who got them rock heads, oh, bro, they, they don't care about getting hit. Oh, bro, they, they, he's like, I just want to kill. It's like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah, this nigga about to be a force, nigga. <laughs> Rock is crazy. Man, them, them messes don't go down easy, bro. That's been the boxing and in real life. Hey, they don't go down easy. <laughs> they be off that Yola. They be on that Yola in their blood. They My mama. <laughs> that Yola is in their blood. Because how the fuck I didn't hit your ass with a, a bat? Bink! And your ass, too. come on, Holmes. Like, nah, <laughs> hell nah, bro. I'm about to shoot your bitch ass. I want you to be like that, Ma. <laughs> nigga is fucked off. You hear me? Your life is. I'm talking about in jeopardy. Like this nigga moved the wrong way. He gonna cramp up everything. <laughs> it's gonna fall. <laughs> it's gonna start a fall. Life alert. Life alert. <laughs> 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 Out of my nigga shot. That nigga Millie. I'm talking and about say, you. Tired too over here. I was doing that fucking with him. I'm definitely yeah. tired, but I was doing that fucking with him though. You said you want to talk about me? Yeah, conflate. Oh yeah, talk about me, conflate, man. Mm-hmm. What is that? What was we talking about the other day? I'm Dallas, right? Definitely, Luke and LeBron. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you said LeBron get hurt, I'm and I'm like, definition. what do you mean? They're trying to. Uh, damn, I forgot. Trying to. Uh, I forgot what it was, but I I, I see what it was saying. I'm trying to figure out why you me bringing up something is taken away from, or trying to diminish. You be talking about something that's in the, you know in the realm of what we talking about, it's but it ain't what we talking about. We talking about Luca and Brian. Yeah, because you said Brian get hurt, and I'm like, yeah, Brian get Brian hurt. Got hurt. Yeah, but Brian, like I when I sent you before, nigga, I think this Luca sixth season, and this the second time he didn't play seventy games, and he just made seventy games this year. His rookie year he played seventy two. In the finals right now. This year he played seventy. He in the finals right now. That's what I'm saying. That's complaining. But we talking about him beating the record. You talking about him beating all the Brian records? Well, if he gonna beat them records. Stats, stats. That's why I, what uh, that thing that you sent. That's why I said it. Like this nigga need to play this many games every year and I'm average thirty five, and saying, he's still gonna fall short. <laughs> he, he, I'm saying well, all I'm saying, and is, he didn't play seventy games and he's not, two he's out not of six horrible. seasons. Bro, listen, nigga, this, LeBron didn't play under saying. seventy games until his tenth year. This is what I'm saying to y'all. I don't really think he gonna break LeBron record <laughs> for real. But I feel like well, uh, y'all niggas see it the same thing I see. He not going to break LeBron record now. But nigga, Luka is the closest thing we have to LeBron right now in young form. As far as, you know. Points, big, rebounds, assists. Getting the triple-double career, the career triple-double. Yeah. yeah. What's the closest thing to it? Like Bron in the playoff, Bron playoff stats was all triple double stats. Like that's the reason why we look at Bron like that. He might can get those. That's what I mean. The playoff ones, yeah. So it's like I feel like, but the he career gonna, re- re- yeah, no, he yeah. not gonna play twenty years. He already like y'all already said he was already pro already. Everything y'all said is true facts. He's been a pro for a long time. He been he got hella miles on his legs and he not athletic at all. So it's like yeah, you you already fucked. Just off of that. But, but they always talking about he's banged up, he's banged up, he's banged up. 
His usage rate. His usage is, rate is, is too, too high, much. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So I, that's why I know for sure. It's like you're not. It's, it's, it's just. It's not gonna happen. Bro. He got like twelve seasons in him, max. Like the nigga gonna be clearly Hall playing of at this rate. He gonna be. Yeah. yeah. He gonna be. He gonna have all those accolades. He's gonna be the second title behind Dirk just because Dirk did it for him first. Like, but he. I, I still feel like Luca gonna get a ring. He gonna get the million dollars. It just ain't gonna be this year. It's like he gonna get the ring when Steph and them leave when they when that when that start to clear up. I feel like he gonna like I feel like he gonna get it, but it's just like them finally getting there. The only person to know about it is Jason Key. I'm not sure about the whole coaching staff over there, but I know Jason Key got one, and Kyrie got one. You know what I'm saying? J uh, no, JT ain't on that because somebody else. But uh, Tyson Chandler. He ain't on that coach staff, but he helped him a lot. Yeah, he, you know he coached the uh, He coached the Lions, bigs. Yeah. So you got some championship mind state there, but when you come to on the floor, Kyrie and Jason Key are the only one that really got that got that experience. I don't feel like Tyson Chandler should be coaching no bigs. For, de- for defense? You want, you want oh, for defense. Okay, never mind. No, it ain't just defense, too. Just being in the just, right spot. Yeah, just being a big. On offense. Like, you're not. I'm just because I'm not. For, the, for whatever I, I, your talent I, I, is. I recant my statement. Yeah, because he can't. wasn't an offensive player. Yeah, that's a, what I'm thinking. Uh, he's I'm, thinking. Lo- I'm catching lobs. No, I'm being yeah. in the right spot to I'm catch that lob. You know I'm, I'm thinking offensive. No, no, no. Nah. He's a defensive prowler, and I'm going to catch a lob. I'll All take right. it back. I ain't taking it from. He, he ain't my facing nothing, none of that. Yeah. That yeah. nigga <laughs> went through none of that. That nigga, <laughs> that nigga push you out the lane going to catch a lob, like running the flow. Like he would run the flow and be in, like you said, be in certain spots. You know what I'm saying? But it was more so like defensive scheme and shit like that. Because, I mean, they got the lively. He going to be good. He young. Gaffrey going to be good. He young. They all like young DeAndre Jordans with a little bit more bounce. Like I ain't yeah, say bounce, but yeah. they just like with a little more life and they young right now. So they got some way so to go. Like Luca young. Yeah, Dallas, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Dallas gonna DJ be good, Washington, bro. Uh, Dallas I don't gonna know be how good, long bro. his contract is. I know they traded for him, but they got a good know. young they got a good young I think uh my boy, UK basketball, he finally in a happy place. He out of you know what I'm saying out of that losing losing place, and like so, it, like everybody over there, like good, bro. Like so, that's gonna have a good team. That they this experience of actually making to the finals is just gonna make them even tougher. But it's just like Boston been so many times, they lost so many times. I guess this is about time. It's like the energy gotta pay them now. Drew you know? over there, and if it took Drew to get there, then that's what it took. Or if it took this, this would y'all say you know when one saying? thing changed? Shit. Oh, that was the other thing I had for you too. It's, it's a fact. The, boy, the even the co- even there. the coach leaving, and then he may, and him and him getting a chance to because one he one he uh was he an assistant coach while Eme was there? What you talking about? Bro, uh, he, the coach was, now. Uh, when he still when he there when Eme was there? He was there, but I don't I'm saying. know what he was doing. I, I, yeah, I, I don't remember, remember him he was being doing. there when Eme was there, but I forgot what he, he was, was there, doing. I just don't know what he was doing. Yeah, I don't remember what he was doing. But now him having that chance and him one thing Drew coming. Could took them no, they lost. Head. Didn't they lose? Yeah, they. He 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 been there. No, he years. been there for two years. Yeah, yeah he been there for two years. But even I, I don't know no rookie coach that won it in their first year neither. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Me, yeah, it, it was Steve Drew. wasn't a rookie I'm, when they I'm won. I'm making more of a case to say it was more Drew than Steve anything. Who? Kerr. He won, that won his first year. No, that his first year. We no. didn't win. Not the, didn't. Okay. No, not the first. Not that first year. That was just. It had. It had to be like his second second year. Cause I thought it was pretty fast. You yeah. know, it was quick because they because they was because I remember they was talking. Yeah, they was that's they why I said way with I Mark. Bro, like yeah. nigga, if Mark stayed, they win. To me, I, hey, we ain't gonna get there. But yeah, that's why I want the Lakers to hire. But I know that's not gonna happen. Well, I don't, JJ, I, JJ I don't got understand that. why he don't got a job still, bro. That shit is crazy to me. JJ got that. But they said they had to. They, they, they was gonna uh, interview Hurley just as a smoke. They start, a lot of people trying to say the story was fake. It ain't well, not fake, but it ain't go the way it's being reported. What the JJ or the Hurley? Hurley? I don't see this nigga leaving a place where he two time champions and and building his own legacy at a, at a place where he ain't got to have them type of expectations. I so know some people be like, well, it's the big it's the big leagues you where think you they want got, to go. Uh, expectations to go to the final. Yeah, the Lakers. The Lakers. Yes, that's always the expectation yes. for LA. It ain't no it's in, yeah, it's, 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 it's yeah, bro, for real. Right, like right. they always, 
And I can't say that it's right or wrong, but hell yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. they they like, they, they title always a the bus. Goal every year. Yeah, them niggas title a bus. I mean, every yeah, it's always. But ain't that goal. ain't for every organization? It's though. always the goal for short. Yes, it is. The goal is to win. Not, not realistically. The goal is, but not, I'm saying not them niggas always doing something to in anticipation. Themselves. Like if okay, if I, we do this, this gonna, gonna put us in finals. position. Yeah. Like them niggas don't, don't draft championship team right now. They don't draft. We ain't won no championships based on who we didn't draft it, or like just strictly niggas ain't built through the drafts. Niggas didn't did free agent trades. I don't think they got a championship team. You don't think they got a championship team right now? No, no, I mean not right now. They the need roster? they need some bigs. <laughs> Bronny ain't on the Listen, roster yet. Bronny ain't even got drafted yet. Bronny, Bronny on the roster already. Don't do that. Bro. You see him at the Lakers practices? Even if so, if we don't get no bigs over there, then the same shit gonna happen. Y'all got AD. AD needs to move the power. Honestly, forward, I bro. think they do though. I think they do have. I think AD a lot of people this year was hurt. AD needs to move the power forward. Okay, LeBron. We need the center. We need two centers. And AD needs to be a power forward, bro. He be powerful. That year that they won, he yeah. be a power forward. He's I'm way more. He's now. way more better than he is at center. Having to play what? real centers and get his ass beat up Do by Jokic. Is the is the is the can we be can we be a um, a finals team? Who the Warriors? Yeah, yeah I, I think y- y'all had niggas. I think y'all was this year. Yeah, yeah y'all was hurt too. Y'all was hurt too. <laughs> Say Clay went down for a minute. Draymond getting suspended for goofy shit like. When y'all got Draymond back, y'all went back to winning again. Like it was just certain. We was damn near, but it was too late. We was down there five hundred. Y'all had a weird season too, yeah, though. Cause y'all, yeah, y'all wasn't, y'all wasn't even winning at home. Like y'all had the same record. That's what I'm saying. On the road and at home, it was weird. We wasn't no fucking championship team this year. I'm had, just saying, looking at it on paper, on paper, on paper, yeah. On paper, don't count. That nice shit. I don't know why shit tastes so good today. I keep on trying to put this bitch down. I know, me too. You see, I'm holding it. I kept picking it up. I'm like, I'm just holding it in my head. head. I'm, 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 I'm never drinking this shit that fast. Never drinking this whole that fast, bro. This oh, motherfucker yeah, is right I'm here. I'm just holding it in my hand. I just keep doing this. I'm just going to hey, just keep it in my hand. This shit tastes like some candy today or something. I don't know. I'm trying to follow my shit. Well, um, <laughs> oh, the luck thing. Yeah, yeah, the butterfly. I was gonna give you on that too, what? nigga. Getting calls mm-hmm. is part of the look of winning the game or winning the series. The officiating. That's luck. Yes, you don't control that none whatsoever. It's just based on who who what referee. I luck though. Some calls not getting called. Some calls getting called. Some calls getting called. Can some getting calls call. getting called on certain people. And some calls getting not getting called on some certain people. Some calls being missed. Or some calls being like, oh, well, that was on him and that should have been on him. It's just a lot of nuances to the shit that, you know what I'm saying, that go on this. And that's the only reason I say it and I repeat it. I repeat it and I can repeat it and I repeat it and I, and I stand on it only because nigga, everybody that want it, like, they always say it. say it come with a little luck and I'd be like I couldn't believe that they be somebody saying, just said it the other yeah. night and they, it, like, in this final even you even be a boy you, you, you oh no Joel it. Joel said it they was on um, on the halftime Joel and B was on the halftime thing oh. and he said yeah we gonna need a little bit of luck him yeah. him not getting hurt Everybody that's another thing up. injuries people getting hurt or not getting hurt is luck yeah Officiating and people getting hurt is two things. Nigga, life, people life on the is court. Luck. Cause I'm not even gonna lie, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. And this may this may sound crazy, but a healthy New York, I think they would have beat Boston. I'm telling you, I, I thought I would I would I was gonna take the healthy New York over to Boston. Listen, <laughs> I said I would I was gonna take Indiana, and them niggas still played them niggas like a motherfucker even without Halliburton. Without Halliburton, <laughs> so them games was close as hell. Boston. I would, I would, I he told was. you I would. He would. I told you. But he said, I that said, though. if anybody can beat them, he it's gonna be them Indiana. because they can score. They the only team, I think, in the league really at the, that could score with them because they was number number one and number two. 
Indiana was one. I think Boston was two. I'm not doing it. It was just written for Boston to win this championship. I'm telling y'all. Bro. Boston was the best team in the playoffs. Right? Boston was the best team in the NBA for a grip. We, and it's just hard because they got to play a lot of East teams. Nigga, New York ain't got nobody that can hold nobody. It, it, I just, the Pacers I, most def- you though. right. I just think they played a good team defense. I don't think it was more so of a one on one thing. They finna get cooked. The niggas too little. Boy, they had all their bigs. Hey, they was they was good. Now I ain't talking about Drew Randall. I think be... Randall gonna. I think I still think Randall should get traded. Oh yeah, yeah. And we should bring yeah, somebody yeah. else in. Not we. I you think Drew was in. gonna clamp Brunson? He was gonna do something that everybody else wasn't. Drew Brunson might have still scored, but he wasn't. He wasn't. He's gonna have to go. I ain't gonna lie to you. I would have wanted to see that. Yeah, I, I definitely would have. I, I want. That's why I want. <laughs> I, I want to see that New York. I didn't even think show. about that. I want to see that. Yeah, I want to yeah. see Brunson you face up with, with a nigga that's not gonna stop. It don't even matter what you do because Kyrie can score on Kyrie score on Drew still right now. Kyrie score on anybody, but man. it just look like it's a lot of it's a different game. You know what I'm saying? Brunson ain't got Tyree handle. He got Kyrie body. He got he got body. I don't know what it but is Drew that Brunson got. Things. Brunson got something that's special about that kid, bro. It's just, just a know how to make space or a wheel or yeah. I don't know what it is. But he just know how to make space and he can recognize. Okay, I got enough space right here to put it up. Then the shiftiness of the damn left hand. That's another thing too. Sometimes you might forget about that. You forget when you about his left, like he's a left hand. So it's like you block, you plan on trying to get the, get your right hand up to get it on the right hand that he's shooting with. But you got to, like, a defender got to make sure they keep it in the left hand up. Man, this is an NBA. But they ain't thinking about that shit because when you watch it, they not guard him that way, though. That's because you can't, though. That's what I'm saying. You you, you guard the nigga in the NBA. It really don't matter if you play him to the right or left at, the, at that point. If it's a ball handler, if it's a good person. If it's somebody, if it's DeAndre Jordan, <laughs> it don't matter. If it's, uh, oh, I ain't going to do that. If it's Karis LeVert, Cam Thomas, like, okay, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. But if it's somebody like Kyrie, Brunson, and Steph, like, it don't matter how you guard the nigga. Something going to happen to you eventually. <laughs> But yeah, I, I mean, yeah, bro. I, I took it back. I said that, Brunson. I hate on you a lot, little nigga. But you good though. I was watching your highlights and shit. Nigga was going crazy. It was going crazy. Them highlights were crazy. That little them highlight reel they put together. Crazy. That one. I was like, damn, this nigga. Is really <laughs> cool. I never watched him when he was at uh, when he in was in Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, I watched him because I was trying to figure out why the fuck they traded him. But then I'm like, him and Luca both need the fucking ball in there. He can't be a ball But player. it don't make no sense. They trade him and get Kyrie. What's the difference? Like, because Kyrie, Kyrie is more receptive to can, playing a second fiddle at this part of his career. No, no, no. Look, this is what it really is. Well, yeah, facts. But this is what it really is. Jalen Brunson can't shoot like catch and shoot. We tried that already. Mm-hmm. When we had Luca, we had every time. I don't know if he was watching them games, but when Luca had the ball, they dishing at Brunson. Some games he was hitting, some games he wasn't. He ain't started really showing out until Luka got hurt and he got the drivers. He seat. got to have the ball in his hand more. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. But him playing catch and shoot, him playing that's, off ball. That's not him. Yeah. Kyrie can just Kyrie can just do whatever. See, it's crazy because he can I ain't gonna say he can't play off ball with his homies, but he didn't play so much ball with them, so it's kinda like if Darius not used to shooting all the time, but you told him to shoot, then he'll shoot because you told him to shoot, not because mm-hmm. it's anybody else, because you told him to do it. It's like, it's the guys. And I ain't playing with two of his guys, so it's like, all right, I ain't got to be so focused on this one thing because I know these niggas can do this one, this, these certain things. And yeah, I could be on the NBA team with niggas, but every nigga on every team ain't friends. You know what I'm saying? So like, yeah, yeah. you play different when you actually get to play with your... Your, your real life best friend and your other homie who you actually won a championship with no matter if it's college or whatever but y'all still won chips together I think that's you cool how they saying? did that though now they got their squad and shit back yeah I don't think they it's gonna help them in like chemistry wise though I don't now they still need they still need bit like they still yeah. need pieces to win a championship that's like a good college pool. college like yeah Josh Hart and DiVincenzo we better than like a lot of niggas if, you're, if they was going against Tatum and Drew and Brown and Porzingis. I think them getting what's-her-name, though, was a big pickup. 
Oh, from, bro, from uh, Toronto. Toronto. Yeah. Yeah, that was huge. That was huge. That was huge. He fit right in with them. And that's yeah. why I said that's just push. Randall I forgot about right bro. out the door. Damn, I forgot about bro. That push yeah. Randall right. Out the, get yeah, man, Randall, but Julius gone. Yeah, give us gone. a give us some bread and some pieces for that nigga, and we gone. G. Where y'all I, think he going? I resigned Harkenshine to a small little contract because he was a good energy guy and he fit right in. But OG really was a major piece, like you said, bro. That nigga was a major piece. Like you think that? How old is Julius Randall? He's saying he old old. He oh, like, like a year older than two. Year older than uh, Anthony Davis. What? OG. He probably yeah, right yeah. at 30. Oh, I'm tripping. I'm yeah. thinking you said Anthony Edwards. I was about to say, what? Oh, he like right at 30. He's on that team right before Anthony got there. So they about just hitting 30? Yeah, I think They finna right turn right him somewhere so he get ready. Go ahead and get ready to get up out the league. I think he ain't getting up out the league, but. I got, I, got, I, got, I, got him, I got him four more years of, 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 yeah. of good play. Yeah. So I'm saying, like, they finna trade him to. Like, they gonna do like they did, uh. DeRozan sent him to Spurs, sent him to Chicago. Chicago ain't really trying to win right now. We just going to put him with somebody and make it look like we trying to win. They going to throw Julius Randle with somebody like... Uh, man, I hope something shake for my boys, man. I don't know who the fuck he can go to. Randle? No, Chicago. Chicago. Oh, Come on, man. now. What you think about the shake? <laughs> Nothing. I just, I'm just staying prayed for you know what I'm saying? Staying yeah. hopeful. Y'all, Chicago can't win because they don't play together. They don't play together. They ain't coaching. Man. It's all type of goofy shit. Man. Niggas, niggas, niggas play trash, bro. Everybody play one on one. I and I like the kid with the fro from Duke. Um, Kobe. Oh yeah, yeah, Kobe. I like Kobe. Kobe hooping. Uh, clearly I like DeRozan, but I don't think DeRozan and Zach fit together. I don't think they do either. It's just two different dynamics. They both need the ball in the hand. DeRozan won't fit with nobody except for a nigga that play. Outside. Like, so he going to be, he going to fill the middle. Yeah. He going to shoot the middies. He he gonna, we he tried the LaMarcus and, and DeRozan. Low key. I think he might fit on New York. Where? DeRozan on New York. Uh they have to give up one of them pieces. I Man, it'll look, it'll be like, ha. Huh? Well, no. Who who would you lose? Who would you lose to put Julius? Oh, are you saying for Julius? Oh, hell, no. Who where he gonna play at? What's who coming one? off the bench? The nigga they just got from Toronto. OG, OG coming off the bench? OG can't. Or, uh, no, 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 no. Probably, probably it, DiVincenzo. It'd be, it'd be, it'd be, it'd be it'd have to be DiVincenzo or Hart. It'd yeah, have to be between one of them niggas because what's name be the one and then the two. <laughs> but no, nah, DeRozan play too slow. Like, he slowed the game down. Like, I don't think he plays slow. He can run. He, I know he, I mean, his, Strength is His half court and yeah, yeah, you know like that mid range, yeah, like but he can run the floor. The, I mean, he might run the flow, but I'm saying like, and I think that'll add to them where it's like, okay, when we can't run the flow, we got somebody to go to that's other than that Brunson. Could. I thought that's what OG was there for. Ain't he? Ain't, can he shoot mid a little bit? Oh, it ain't. It ain't offense ain't, ain't really. It's yeah, defense it more. Like but it, Toronto it lost OG and Siakam. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking about it now. And Fred. All in the year and a half. Two years <laughs> Went down drain fast. From a Who championship. Who the fuck do they have? Scotty Barnes. Just Scotty? That's the only person I could think yeah. of. What's the name? Who? The, the, ain't what's the name over there? The Canadian? Uh, Steve Nash got some. The one oh, R.J. Beard. Yeah. <laughs> That's Steve Nash got some? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they, they, him and his daddy Steve Nash and RJ Barrett daddy grew up together in, in Canada and shit oh uh, <laughs> type shit well yeah RJ Barrett is trash yeah that's why the story was so big when he had came out cause it was like oh it's Steve Nash yada 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 and I was just like bro he's a Duke kid only Duke oh, he ain't trash RJ Barrett Grant, Grant Hill and Kyrie trying, Irving bro. he weak though and I fuck yeah. with JJ, but Grant Hill and Kyrie Irving are the only Duke niggas I'm really giving it to. Yeah. Tatum? 
Zion. Come on, I just picked JB over Zion. Zion. I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just naming him. I just Zion, picking no, I, 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 I don't care what no nigga say about Zion. That nigga is a monster. Yeah, he a monster, bro. That nigga don't get injured for a whole season. I'm talking about like like niggas is like this my team. Like we seeing like everybody get. That's why I said is JT the is he the more talented or he is the more all around better basketball player? And I got to get that to JB because it's like nigga sometimes JT just disappear. You be like nigga with your body frame six ten nigga your shooting be like you should be shooting too many. Threes, he's not a two way player for real. He's not. Bro, this, it, it, they be trying to act like they be trying is. to act like he is, but he's not, not though, bro. He should be at six ten or whatever the fuck. I mean, he yeah, is. Exactly. He you should <laughs> be at six ten, bro. Like you should be. He you shoot not. over the top every time. But if you get if you give a little bit on defense, you can be a killer, bro. But you just be like, I'm gonna get it to my bro. I'm gonna let JB do it. Like, bro, all right. That's I why I know J- this nigga JB was uh, smart like that. This nigga smart as a fuck. Oh, yeah. Smart, you said. <laughs> It's like what the fuck? That these niggas was teaching a uh, over space uh, class yeah, or some uh, shit. I was uh, like, what the fuck? Over Brainiac, bro. Over Brainiac. These little niggas do everything now. Shit, you had that cheese. What would you do? Learn as much as you can. But he was yeah, doing that before that. He was though. doing that before that. <laughs> yeah. I'm saying, I'm saying, it's coming in too. When he was in school, he 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 had bro. Like when he was in school, he, they knew he was going to the league. He said, but he nah, but he was, he was trying to be. He was like on some education shit. Even when he like, I know I'm going to the league, but I'm still like trying. To, I mean, yeah, yeah. What would you? I'll tell my son same shit, nigga. Yeah, you going I'm to saying, the that's, league, whole ass nigga. But hey. that's rare though to to even want to have to give more your plates because to study and do shit like that to that to that magnitude is is tough. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't easy. Most niggas that go, oh, yeah, yeah. I know I'm going to to the league. I'm not even going to class. Like you know how niggas. Be I think going. that's, I think that's my our, our generation, my friend, more so. Really though, I think nowadays it's a little different. It depends on the type of niggas that you're around, but I think these little niggas nowadays could do everything. Really, that's why. I mean, I I, I was telling nigga because I was, bro, I seen this nigga. Clearly, I see the. I, I seen Addison the other day, and then yeah. Like, Matter of fact, yeah, there you go. Right. And I seen him the other day. And I was like, the nigga grew like two more inches. I was like, bro, like damn, like damn. I just bought you some hooping shoes like three months ago. And it was eight and a half. Now this nigga need a nine and a half. Hmm. Evolution. Bro. That's how I be. I'm not, I'm not ready for that shit. I did the same thing though. Bro, it's crazy. <clears throat> nigga, I was every year I was a shoe size up. It's crazy, bro. It's crazy. <laughs> it's it went up. Crazy, oh, next year. Bro, oh, like, new new no shoe size. I'm telling you, it's the craziest thing. And then but it's crazy when you don't notice it or how you don't notice it. And it's like I I'm it's not like it's like months in in, in time. I'm, it's like I think I'm seeing you at least once a week at the at the least once a week. And it's like, bro, what the fuck? I'm not gonna notice that you just getting like. That's crazy to me, but I love that little nigga though. His mindset is so different. I'm talking to the coach. That nigga say, "Yeah, man." Addison was just he just won't leave the gym. He said, "His Ashton working at the gym where they be playing that, and he be leaving." And I say, "Bro, you got a Vertimax there. You got all these shits there to get better." Why is your little brother staying until this bitch closed down? Like why? Why ain't? Why am I coming to pick him up and he only only him there and you ain't that getting? Up? And it's free. I said, you know, I mean, like it, die to live to 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 get this type of shit to get this type of work. What? This nigga made the this nigga made the the uh the seven grade the seven grade team the AU team and still only who with his age group so he who with his fourth grade team. But he made the seventh grade team. You know what I'm saying just because the nigga, like they said, the nigga be hustling too. And they had called and asked me, like, yeah, it's gonna be a little more strenuous. Like we gonna be working out a little bit more. And I said, bro, if he can handle it, then I don't care. And if he want to do it, then let him. And they no, was like, yeah. nah, he be over there because we they put him on teams. He was over there just watching. And then the coach was seeing him watching him, what they was doing, and then he go to the other court and then do it, and then come back to their court, watch, 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 and then go back to the other court and then try to do it. And then dude was just like, just come to our practice. You know what I'm saying? And shit, the nigga wasn't scared. That shit remind me of Peter. And that's why. I, then that's what made me say what I said earlier. Cause I was like, well, nigga, if he doing that, I'm like, 
And maybe mm. it is time for me to bring them out to, to some grown like get them bumped around. Oh, what you say? Oh, yeah, yeah, I want them yeah. get them bumped around. No, no, I want them get bumped around. Like, take these hits. Yeah, no, no, that's what you're supposed to Like, do. Come, come on now. Now, if you're really talking about this, this is what you really want to do. Come take these real hits. And ain't no crying, ain't no foul calling, ain't nobody gonna take yourself. Like, niggas gonna play. And let me see what you really made of, because this is what you really wanna do. I'm gonna put you through some fire. No, that's what you uh... But the nigga, be, yeah, the nigga be on his on his Vertimax, the nigga be on his poly 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 metrics. He be the nigga's crazy, bro. Like the nigga, I'm telling y'all, bro. Y'all nephew something different, bro. I swear to God. I swear to God. I know that shit be blowing you how, they, how different they are. It's but I should do because I I'll, I'll, I'll be thinking about that off, just bro. like it's me as an only me child because it's like I don't know like I ain't I ain't see that growing it up so when I see off, other people it's like y'all got the same parent why the fuck y'all so different it pisses me <laughs> out because I be like, <laughs> I should, I should. <laughs> he basically was saying that yesterday too it's weird bro because I be I be like bro it's the craziest thing to tell him to, to, to me I tell do to be like bro. It's multiple areas where you need to be like your little brother. It's hard to say that. But I had to say it because it's like, bro, he gives the effort in school. You don't. He gives the effort in the things that he want to do when it comes to sports. I'm not forcing him to do none of this shit. Like, because my whole thing was as being a pops, like I never wanted, like I never had the person there to be like, hey, I'm going to help you reach the goals that you want to reach. It was just like, well, this is what you want to do. I'm going to show you how to get there. And that's really it. Like, I'm not going to be there. Like, I'm just going to give you the two. Do the minimum. Damn, the, 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 the minimum. <laughs> not even. I'm going to I'm give you the bus card to get yourself there. Yeah. Like, I'm not taking you to practice. I'm not showing up with no games. I'm not doing none of that shit. I'm not buying none of that you need. Whatever you need, you really got to get it. Like, type shit. But, nigga, you got everything that you ask for when it comes to every sport that you ask for. Training shit, I got all of that, and you don't put that to use. But your little brother do. And I don't say this; it's the same shit. I'm not forcing him to do it. He's calling me, woo 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 woo, trying to learn. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, nigga, you're it's a personality sick. thing, bro. It's it's and that's what it what that's what it but that's what it boils down to. And I told him, I said, dude, by eighth grade going to my freshman year, nigga, I was pretty much the same height. I'm like, I I dunk. I'm the summer of my eighth grade year going to my freshman year for the first time, rim grades. Boom. I say, yo, you're three inches taller than what I ever was. <laughs> I would have been all oh, type of shit at 6'3. What? Man, what? And I say, you can barely graze the rim, bro. That's embarrassing to me. I feel like I fucked up. <laughs> and I'm talking to the coach, and he, man, yeah, so, but yeah, but. But he gonna find. He gonna find. His but we got. Hey, boy, whatever. look at look at this nigga schedule. Look at this nigga schedule for tomorrow, and I'm about to be at this bitch. I'm about to be at this bitch. Do he like? Do you think he really likes sports? We about to find out. Oh. <laughs> look at look at look at the schedule tomorrow. That's for tomorrow. I'm about to see how dedicated he was. Because at first he called me today and was asked me, "Can he stay at his homie crib?" And I'm like, "Nigga, you got a whole. I can't believe you asked me a phone. You got some money that you got to make tomorrow. You got a whole work, day of workout. Oh, oh. He first he's making. He got to work. He got he got to work and he get a paid. Whole day. He get paid to work. You know what I'm saying? For 14 years old, he get paid to work, and then all that shit. And this is free, bro. All this shit is free. Niggas who got to get this paying for each one of them sessions. Come on, man. You got the tools to be the great. That's a whole day. And that's how you it should two be. two hours of breaking there. Well. That's how it should be. What else you got to do with your life? Hanging out with your friends? You got to sacrifice something. If, you, if this is what you really want, something got to be sacrificed. Everybody is different. Maybe show y'all want something. I don't know. That's just what she asked. That's no, right. we already got the beverages. Yeah. But yeah, though. So and when, we, when we, when me and him and the coach talking, it's good to cause you know what I'm saying. You know, well, nigga, school when them boys get older, it's gonna be shit that me and Dare's gonna be able to tell them that they ain't gonna fucking listen to you about. And that just is what it is. It's certain shit that I, that I talk to this nigga about. And be like, hey. You could tell them you could when you see them, you could tell them shit that they're gonna listen to that that is just not gonna listen to me about. It's just 
I don't know. It's fucking weird, bro. Yeah, I had to show that nigga that. Like I said, that day we went to the gym. I'm like, yeah, your daddy be busting your ass, bro. But I'm gonna bust your ass for real. I'm gonna bust your ass, and I ain't gonna show you no love. Yeah, the same way bring him next Saturday. Yeah, nah, I am for sure. Yeah, show. I'm bringing both of them, but I know that nigga Addison really gonna benefit. But I'm gonna bring both of them though. I'm bring Ashton too. Y'all gonna see him, bro. Like this nigga, bro. This nigga just big. I ain't so big for nothing. Somebody follow me. Nigga just big, bro. The nigga just big, bro. That's your phone. No. It ain't mine. Mine ain't ringing. No, nigga just big, bro, bro. But I don't know. It's just that. that I know when that I generation at that gym that that day. I'm like, damn. Oh, you taller than me. The fuck? I'm six four. I'm still. Damn, they look like he weighed more than me too. Shit. We wear the same pants. <laughs> what size pants you wear? 34, 36? 34. He wear 34. The nigga in a 13 and a half shoe. Oh yeah, he got a bigger foot than me. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah he bigger foot than there me. There you go, Maul. <laughs> Get you a little wake up. Yeah. You been sleeping for like 30 up. minutes. Tad it up. <laughs> Tad it up. <laughs> One at, one at the top, and then we can wrap it up. Yeah, things you didn't don't like or expect from parents. I give y'all an example of the reason why I wrote that up there. Mm-hmm. I hate that I gotta talk to other kids' parents. You just hate to talk. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga crazy That bro. shit bro Be irking the fuck out of me bro Going to birthday parties Asking me all these questions I'm like bro Just let the kids do what they doing We gonna get up out of here uh, That's like I don't like that either <laughs> I definitely don't wanna talk that much I know I'm not like, I will get on my phone And play a, a game And be so disassociated That you don't even wanna Even come over there I be doing okay. nigga. I be having my headphones in. People still come up and talk to me, Listen, dog. What kind of parties? Are we you was at to? the no. It don't even just be at the park. At parties at the park, nigga. No. I took them to the park oh. the other day, and I had and the lady sat next to me. I had the headphone. I only had one headphone in, so she don't even know if I had what headphone and shit. At the uh, wreck, yeah. Oh, I had so the I'm headphone right here. This goddamn. She still, yeah, yeah. for sure, sure. Yeah, she yeah. still talking to me, and this wasn't even a parent. This was a grandparent, their grandma. Oh, for sure, hell, your grandparents. <laughs> and I got talk. the headphone right here. You can, she can see it. She's they, sitting on this side. They gonna talk, and she's still talking to me. You talking about grandparent? Yeah, she don't give a fuck about no headset in your ear. <laughs> I'm like, damn, lady. But I mean, she not a old. She not our grandparents' age, nigga. She she our parents' age. Type shit. <laughs> Man, my mama still. My mama still goddamn. She. I think she was younger than my mama. <laughs> my mama still gonna talk to you with the headphone in. But I, I, I agree to what what you said a little bit. I don't know though. Uh, that shit be irking me. I'm, and some people be asking for my number and shit. And I'm like, I'm definitely not doing. You be giving niggas your number. Ain't nobody never hit me up. I'm but never we didn't exchange right number. number. If a nigga got a kid and he, he friends with my kid, bro, you better get my your girl better get my girl number. Oh, <laughs> that shit. If you if you ain't my nigga, bro, if you ain't the homie, bro, so I'm not finna never, never. I'm never finna. We going to the birthday party, the desired friends birthday party. I'm never talking to that daddy. It's weird because a lot of the times, like, unless it's my homies, like, if it's like, like, y'all, Shara or Larry or, or Robbie or something, then I'm cool because of my homies. But if it's somebody like a parent, like, that I know my kid, like, he know the kid, or I know the kid, I'm damn near, I'm damn near fucking around, probably not gonna go in. Like, a lot of Addison parties, I'll sit in the car, listen to a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> He talking about me. <laughs> That's crazy. Nigga didn't even, walk Nigga didn't even go in. I didn't go in, man, for real. <laughs> if I don't focus you like that, I'm not about because I don't like to funny kick it, bro. I can't, yeah, I, I can't do that, do that, bro. Shit, bro. Like, so I'm not, that's what I be saying. Like, let's so just chill. I'm not trying to. Energy. I'm not even gonna go in. I will sit out there. I sit out there the whole time. But I'm not. What do you do? <laughs> what do you do for a living? Uh, yeah, it's, How long like, y'all been? Y- y'all bro. from Texas? Yeah. yeah. So where's the mom? It's like, bro. 
<laughs> Fuck out of my business, bro. Like, God damn. What's wrong with you, bro? Not here. Clearly, yeah, that's clearly all you need to know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was, yeah, I still just call like a hoe. Well, like I said, I if really don't know, bro. Yeah, if it's somebody I know I'm cool with, and I'm cool. Like I said, but that's low and few because if it ain't Char, Larry, or or Robbie or y'all, then then like I said, I'm damn not probably even going in to be honest. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, and we didn't got invited we, at the soccer game when Denver was playing soccer. This lady invited us to. Uh, we didn't go, but uh, invited us to uh, come over because they was uh, grilling or smoking. Doing something. Don't you hate when they get a kid's invitation? Because now you feel like you obligated to take the kid too. And you be like, "Fuck!" <laughs> they be so excited to go to the party. They have the little invitation exactly. and shit. And be like, "Fuck!" <laughs> they remind your ass every go. day. Like, is it ain't for the time of the party, yeah. nigga? And then you got teacher has his calendar. Like, nigga, that's next week, two weeks from now, bro. Stop fucking ask me about this goddamn party, nigga. And then <laughs> School God. nigga, we went to plenty. You know they just got here. We went to like five birthday parties, nigga. Yeah, you, you five, was yeah. He was telling me that because they had to invite the whole class. <laughs> like they can't just invite certain people at the school. They, I guess it was a rule at the school. I remember like that. if you come yeah. in, you got to invite the whole class. And boy, you ain't about to tell me why I can't invite to my kid party, bro. I'm about to get. Hey, give me y'all kid. Give me this number. Like, give me this number. Yeah, number. I see you outside. Yeah, see yeah, the yeah, parent I'm, outside. I'm, hey, you what? Uh, definitely not about to do that. <laughs> I don't want to. Yeah, that shit was nigga. We went to plenty birthday parties. I'm like, what the fuck? Why they got a? Because I, I said, I'm like, why? He, how you got a birthday party every weekend? Damn near. You got me fucked up. She's like, like, that's, that's a rule a at the school. When I read the things, that's it's a, a lot, rule. bro. I was like, oh my god. Having all them parties, that's baby. Having all them yeah, parties and shit is like, yeah. I don't want to shake your hand. Man, if our kids it. get to the point where they like, I want to go over their house, they want to come, all right, then we can start. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, I yeah. think we ain't going to do that now. We just coming to this party. Oh, my, my, my. You, you <laughs> might not see me again. Yeah. No, that ass, bro. It might be. That ass might not Tell see me. me again, bro. Like I said, it's been plenty of parties. Bro, especially when Addison, and, uh, when he first came down here, and he was playing for a football team in Carrollton. It was all cups of milk, bro. No, I was doing drop offs. <laughs> they was about to be out there wild. Nice. <laughs> no, you can go ahead and sit down. You ain't got to stand up behind the curtain. I'm watching y'all. Stay focused. Wild. Stay Ryle. <laughs> that's funny. That's what they go. That's how they go say it. No, oh, dead ass. <laughs> that shit. And they and they always be thinking that. And the so first thing, Ryle. and the first thing they be coming, to, they would be like, they think that she gonna speak. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I'll be like, Yo, what up? And they just be like, Oh, yeah. um, <laughs> <laughs> hi. How you doing? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm I know. Not, that's why I, I had to change mine. So that's why I always I always say to everybody, like, I just say what's going on. That's all I say. Well, I'll try to adopt that to say it to everybody. Like I feel like that's a well-rounded Bro, yeah, thing man. to say to anybody. It's, it's, it's unisex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't no. Hey, hey, how you doing? It ain't that. But it ain't no. Hey, what up? Don't do that. I You gonna catch it, Paul? I'm not gonna do it at all. He did it. He did. Damn, he caught that hoe, yo. Maybe you got to be sleepy to be athletic. Damn, <laughs> <laughs> this is some bullshit, bro. Because <laughs> you, you fake made that look. And that was a little bit of a skill. And that was a big That's lighter. what I was going to say. It, it, it was that something small that was easier to catch. He can grab it in his own hand. He <laughs> 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 can just grip that motherfucker like... Y'all think it's funny. You can put that you shit know, in the vicinity of right here, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna it's gonna be a thing here. now until you just consistently just. Yeah, it's and definitely. even when you do it, we still gonna be like, "Hey, remember when you couldn't catch?" <laughs> hey, you, back at back at eighty five, you have to acquire the skill of catching. Like, damn, I remember when your ass used to drop everything. Don't worry. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait till you meet the rest of your family. Niggas, got, like, niggas got hands now. You always been clumsy. I'm gonna ask mom next time I see her. I oh, am. Yeah, I catch more than you, though. Pause. Yeah. I had to pause that. Yeah, he's just clumsy. 
You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't know, man. I, I don't have no, uh, I don't have any, uh, no. <laughs> this just look just like you. So it'd be All like, right. you tell yourself no. Like, mm-hmm. it's just like, I'm telling you so. I mean, about to leave. <laughs> <laughs> I can be looking like, I can't tell myself no. Like, that's especially girl shit. version, I just be like, oh, fuck that. Hell yeah. There's two yeah, times I got be, to, yeah. bro. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's cause you don't know. You don't With know a girl, yet. yeah, I ain't gonna know, know yet. You don't it ain't know gonna happen, us. so I ain't no. gonna never know. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna never know. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, hey, man. bro. I done said yes so I ain't many gonna times. Have I'm I... Probably not, but if I do, I ain't gonna have no girl. It ain't gonna happen. And then in the car, you spending that bread. You spending you that bread? Control. If I decide to, can, I might. You can control it. If I decide to have another you, you kid, I be, might. You can be persuasive. I just know it ain't in the cards for me. I ain't got sisters. Nigga, your I cousins ain't. got sisters? You an anomaly, bro. <laughs> I, I you, went, you pop out I, that girl. Women ain't a common thing. Nigga, I got way more uncles than I got aunties. I was about to say pause, but I'm going to do you like that. I got way more uncles than I got auntie. Women, women ain't a common thing. In my family, I'm saying. I know, I know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> bless them. Bless them, man. I'm, t- I'm, I'm really, things you don't expect or like about parents, I don't really have nothing off top of the head right mm-hmm. now. I wouldn't expect any all to. I really don't like that I got to tell these niggas the same thing over and over after a time frame when I didn't have to tell them the same things over and over. Repeating yourself you don't like. Yeah. It was, it was a time where I didn't have to repeat myself. It's not it's not there anymore right now. I don't like I don't like that. They put on their own people. No, it's, it's not their fault. I mean it is their fault, but it ain't their fault solely. So that's the part. That's what I'm saying. That I ain't got to yet. That I, I I think about all the time too, when they become their own people. How they gonna and be? There gotta be a level of respect to that. What the, What you mean? Like they gonna make their own decisions? Oh yeah, I'm I might let you not like it. it, but I'm saying I might not like it. But what I'm gonna do? Oh yeah, I, I've been thought about that. <laughs> so it's I just like mob, like mob being paused. What? Look the out. fuck you just say? My bad. I ain't mean to tell your secret. I asked him. I, I want to know what if he was if he is. How you know? Why you know that? <laughs> that day he left his phone. That day he left his phone. It's, it's, a, it's a joke. It's probably gonna get cut out. It ain't. Don't nobody crazy. we ain't seen they ain't seen Maul, they don't know who Maul is. He he uh I guess the people that know us and be around and we be like, oh this Maul. He got a light skin. He a light skin friend that look like Michael Jackson. Well you like that compliment, huh? No. But I'll see the funniest shit. You can say that. A nigga, nigga can take any compliment in the world or comparison until you compare him to a pause nigga. Then it's like, oh, no, nah, you tripping. I said, no, damn, that's damn mere fact, though. Don't compare me that. to no pause nigga. No, I've seen that, with, do that with the women. Nigga say, you look like Tyrese. All right. You look like... You look like Frank Ocean. Like Nas Come, on, oh. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Bro, don't Come do that man. shit, bro. <laughs> don't do that Come shit on, to man. me, nigga. It's funny because they said that they said the same thing for women, though. Come They'd on, They'd be man. like women to say, uh, uh, what's the big girl name? That Lisa. same Lizzo. Oh, Lizzo. They'd be like Lizzo, beautiful. And then, and then so when you, you look say like they me. look like Lizzo, they look. Oh, fuck. <laughs> No, nah, bitch, nigga, you beautiful. Niggas don't want that compliment. <laughs> no, nah, bitch. Niggas don't want that compliment. Hey, listen. They only, hey, 
Hey. Them, hey, hey, big Lizzo's girls. getting knocked out. Listen, hey, big. Girl, I was hey, gonna say it listen, too. Listen here, I might, y'all, I y'all, might take that y'all, list. y'all, y'all keep on being confident. How y'all be confident? You're because listen, y'all, hey, don't nobody got more confidence than the big girl who love herself. You hear what I'm saying? Because they go outside, nah, stomachs they, they out. Got, they got something other than confidence. Hey, they losing. Whatever you want to, hey, confidence, I ego, see, I seen them put on pride, some shit, you know, goddamn and well. you know goddamn well. Oh, but to me, to on. me, see that that'd be the thing for if me. If you put that shit on, that mean you got like you you like fuck it. No, I'm about that to, ain't that ain't it. Dude. Hey, it, it, it ain't that for me. I'm saying for them, if they got the confidence to put that on and come outside in, then hey. I tell me you don't care. You don't have to put yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, you, you don't could. have to put I that on. You, you can care. still put something else you can on and still look good. Oh, my yeah. mom, you can hey. you can feel sexy and wear some shit. I feel the same about women that can put it on though. That's not big. I ain't gonna say that can put it on, mm-hmm. but that's not big. Like, can you look good without it's be being naked? It's gonna be two different things because you said a, a big woman and like, but every, still, it's not it's not attractive to the eye for the main. Property of people, you see what I'm saying? So for them to do it, I'd be like, "Damn, you have the audacity to come outside like that." Somebody that's, gonna that's like terrible. it. Terrible. <laughs> but I mean, but so, excuse me, somebody gonna like it. A yeah, lot of people like, is. Bro, like, but still, I'd be like, "Damn, that's crazy to me." But then I have to think about it, like, bro, that's a major confidence to be like, still to "I'm me, about to go and do it." To me, can you look good without being damn near naked? It ain't even a fact Cause that's just even, like Do you know how to dress Do you know how to put some shit yeah, on It ain't I was about to say It ain't Especially even the fact Especially being, being from naked. the north Like you nah, can't be sure. You can't be naked all the time <laughs> Yeah yeah It ain't even about being naked It's about the outfit choice Like bro Don't wear the tightest jeans That you got And the Shirt that show The most of your belly Like bro like <laughs> This nigga said the most of your belly I'm saying Don't 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 do that I was gonna. I ain't gonna do that to you. Wear an oversized fit. shirt with the fit, like See, go they, crazy. But they don't want to seem like they gotta wear big shit and hide their bodies. What they want to be it like? It ain't about hiding. It's like some shit just don't look right. You don't have to hide. It ain't hiding your body though. It's you could still wear something kind of form fitting. You know what I'm saying? Not, like, it, it, I know. Listen, like like what you say in school. I'm agreeing <laughs> with everything I'm saying because <laughs> it don't negate because of what I be saying about the reg- to other the regular size women. What I'm saying yeah, for them because you don't they, want your woman to wear. Don't, don't say regular exactly. size. Don't say regular size. <laughs> I don't. I ain't trying to. Smaller size. I ain't trying to. Hey, ladies, don't don't hop on my coat tail. I'm not trying to be on that. I'm just saying the different sizes of women. I love them all. What I'm saying is but that you don't care what size your woman is. You don't want her. I don't, if my girl was if my girl's a big lady, I don't want you out there in a thong just because oh, I'm a big girl. I'm a sh- I don't care. No, bitch, you're not about to wear no thong out there. Like, dress that and shit that ain't up. got nothing to do because you got, big. No, it don't. It's because you mine. Like you my lady. Like so, you're not about to be doing that. But they be like, well, the skinny hoe or this girl doing it or this girl. So I'm gonna do it too. So it get them that mindset. So I'm gonna be like, bruh. That's what I be saying. So they be like, not saying Everybody that it's cool. Everybody want to me too. Yeah, yeah. It ain't not not saying that they want to be. I'm saying that it's cool, but they doing it because they like what well, the little girls doing it. So I'm gonna do it too to the ones but that have that do it, do it, about do it your way. Like find a way to do it for too. you. That's gonna fit you. You ain't got to do exactly how they be doing. Because even even in that, to me, even just outside of you being big, it's just like. Okay, you don't even know how to do your own thing. Yeah. You just you ain't doing this because somebody style. else. You ain't even you. Oh, like, you're not even you. That's why I said, do you know how to fucking dress without just being naked like everybody else? What, what do you like to put on? When you go shopping and you don't look at Instagram. What you going to put on? Can I look right. at you with some clothes on and be like, damn, she's sexy as hell. And it ain't, it ain't a titty or an ass cheek showing? That's Sex appeal. That's yeah, sex. Appeal. That's different. That's major to me. For me, that's major because if I can look at you like that, then it don't matter what the fuck you put on. I'm like nigga can have on a damn uh, turtleneck dress. I'm like, God damn. Listen, nigga, we used to be like nigga. Tony Braxton never, and she kept the sex but To me, it's random. But Tony Braxton never was like showing shit. But she always had this like. Subtle sex appeal to her that was just like, damn, this is just she. She's so mysterious. I just want to know what's underneath. Nigga, yeah, my number one celebrity crush was tomboyish as hell, but she, who? Th- Tiana Taylor. She be, oh, nigga, she, girl, she nigga. I mean, she be wearing other shit, but nigga, even if she put on that tomboy shit, and even earlier on, 
She was more tomboy than what she is now. And shorty, she shorty still come to the date with you. Six X pants on, six X T shirt on. You on a date? Balenciaga boots. I'm not. You talking about like the design? I'm not into that really. Balenciaga boots, big ass pants, big ass jersey. That's tomboyish. The outfit that uh somebody had on had to be scissor hat on in a rich baby daddy video. Bigger, a little bit bigger than that though. The pants was big as hell. Big as hell. Bell bottoms. It's fine to me. We're not going to. We're not going no, to. No, no, it's all this. Restaurant. Yeah, we scale. is. That's where we going we to the restaurant. No, you said you had a baseball jersey on. We can go to the movies. Me? Yeah, you said you got the baseball jersey Me? on. Me. Yeah. I don't want my girl wearing that. We can go to the movies. That's kind of fucked up. Go to what? the concert. I don't want you dressing like me. You ain't got no six X pants on. But you see what I'm saying though, like you know what I'm saying. But so it's not dressing like you. Yeah. A man, bro. So you don't like that? I'm saying like six X is crazy. Like, like the boyfriend. I mean, you <laughs> wearing it, wearing it, it. I mean, it's they size, nigga. It's no, just no, happened to be baggy. Jeans. It's a the, different the cut. waist. Be they size, the, but yeah. the cut of the jeans just be <laughs> big because that's what how they. That's how oh, they well, I mean, it's just a style that you don't like. Yeah. No, I'm not gonna even say I don't like it because you can wear, it, but like. It depends on where we at. I'll say that. That's what I just said. That's what you said? <laughs> yes. Oh, so I shit. said we not going to the uh, restaurant with that. We can go to the movies. We can go to a concert. We can oh, go okay, to, okay, okay. We can okay. do stuff like I that. Say that part, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't wear that shit to, to our anniversary. Yeah, no, hell no. No, nah, hell no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Don't me, wear that shit. Yeah, it's like me. I, you know, Unless I'm, we going to a concert. Y'all know damn well I'm going to throw them Crocs on at any given time. But I'm not going to throw the Crocs on. We got to go out somewhere like crazy. Mm. But I'm going to put them Crocs on, though. I'm, slide, I'm sliding to them Crocs. Listen, they make them. Some dress with the ass out. Huh? Why the ass out? Wait, yeah, wait, what? What? That's just how the dress came. Flashing over. No, nah, see, on some on some ass out dress, that's me, you, at the beach, us, dinner by ourselves, nobody else there, ass out, some about to, yeah. To the movies. No, bro, why? What, what, if they why? Made the, what if they made the dress like they made the Air Forces? With the the see through Air Force? The back see through. <laughs> only, the, only the back portion is see through. Listen, they might have something <laughs> out there. They be wearing all this see through <laughs> shit anyway. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's an outfit out there like that. It's jeans and I'm pretty sure it's an outfit out there like that, bro. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't be I wouldn't surprised. put it past it already. It's already made. And Maul, then, Maul got some. Oh, my God. <laughs> Call the nigga Prince. <laughs> <laughs> got the chaps. <laughs> I'm just trying to wake you up, man. I know you're tired. <laughs> Michael Jackson got some. And that's your favorite artist. He has some. Yeah, them niggas going that's crazy in here. Artist. One of them. Shit. Niggas down there choked me last week for this nigga. Michael Jackson, nigga, he was number one. Well, they, they gonna be, it's going to be next week. Dude, 1999. Nah, for real. <laughs> no. I say it's going to be next week for the people that's watching. Maybe <laughs> next week that's going to come up. Mm-hmm. Niggas, niggas said, mm-hmm. Michael Jackson, nigga, so he. So cool. Tomless. Mm mm-hmm. mm. Mm-hmm. Bro, it's some it's a sexy red song that might be timeless. Listen, as whack as that Cult. damn, yeah, as whack as that damn song is, nigga, that shit come on in the club. That shit ain't timeless. No, I'm not saying that it's timeless. I'm about to say. I'm saying I'm just saying the uh, fact of how whack it is. Oh yeah, yeah, it's go crazy though. But it go crazy in certain settings to the point where it's it's on the billboards because it just go crazy in those settings. So niggas is playing it. Because it go crazy in certain settings, and this song is trash. Like it's really trash. Like she really sounds terrible. She do. But niggas is in that bitch singing that bitch, and I'm talking about, bro. Word for word, made for me word, realize, bro. bro I could word for word. I could have been rich. I've been doing songs like this, and niggas was telling me, "Nobody want to hear that shit like that, bro. You gotta really go in there and do a professional." Bae, I love I've you. I've been in the studio you playing play around this shit. Where that one bitch is coming from? Go in there and play around. Pause and see what happened. Oh, Did you watch that, that shit I sent you? The, uh, the music thing? 
I watched like an hour of it. I ain't watched the whole thing. Mm-hmm. It was too. It was too. It'd be hard for me to watch Joe, bro. Did you go? You know what I mean? What did you say? It's hard for me to watch Joe. I don't like. When I, I wanted did. you to see the part where they was talking about the Drake shit. Oh, I didn't see that part. Damn. That's the part. He you, asked him yeah, about. You would have liked it, but it, he asked him about. You seen it too? And when he when he like I, I, certain Joe clips that he be putting up. Especially about that when that Drake show was going on, that should be everywhere on the internet. You know, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm, I'll be watching podcasts. I'll be when it comes to podcasts, you can clickbait the say? fuck out of me because I'm going, I'm going to see who, who they're talking about. What did he say? He was just asking them certain questions around it, around the stuff that he said, which I know you saw that stuff mm-hmm. that yeah. Joe was saying about what his theory is. They was, they was even oh, saying oh. they, they, and like, the way he answered the questions, it was like. Kind of weird. But even when Joe was saying, they were saying they don't think that this type of song was the first song that he should have came out with after the beef, but but look what's happening to it, though. It's not a good song, but it's transcending to the point where it's being played Yeah, because he's looking at it from a hip-hop sound. And, but you, but, but, but that's my but problem with I Joe, because you can't I don't look at it from that's, just that's that one true, perspective, though. I don't though. think that's true. What? what you just said. But it's being played everywhere. I done been in four or five different settings since this shit came out. Like old, new, Vanetti. I was at Vanetti's old heads and it's getting played and old heads in this bitch singing this whole game. I'm saying like, it's the, 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 the group of niggas that's playing a song. But why do that matter? That don't listen, matter listen, to Drake. Listen, can I finish? I'm the, doing what the you group, do. <laughs> the, group, the group of niggas that play the song uh, is like a, it's very specific, bro. So it don't matter. Like I'm realistically, we not playing that fucking. Why? Song. Why it don't matter though? Because I'm saying it's is when you come back, bro. Well, I'm not saying that to to say what you saying. Like the first song to come, I definitely don't think you should have came out with that song first, and then rapping over BBL. But Dreams, for one, it's not even my song though. It's just a. I'm, I'm a feature. I mean, yeah. So yeah. So it's not. That's what I'm saying. So I'm not saying it more so to say this is Drake's first song out. But why the fuck would you? Yeah, have, I mean, to, technically speaking, he don't have a first song out yet. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Like two or three feature. songs that's that he came saying. out with. Yeah, that's what all, I'm saying. So I'm not yeah. saying what I'm about to say. It ain't got nothing to do with that strictly or specifically. I'm saying, why would you rap all BBL Drizzy? Nigga said. When you see when you when you stand next to sexy red, you think you see two bad bitches. And then you, come you might pop ass with them, and then you did a song with her. That's been, the first thing that I've came been, out after that. I've been fucking with BBL her. Why would I stop fucking with this person? I'm saying that's I've not the first thing I'm finna. I'm not. I'm not. I'm me personally. I'm not doing that. You know, we always we always break it down to a personal thing. We can't do that for one. He's a light skinned nigga, bro. Ain't none of us light. I'm just telling you what I. I'm not. I, so I'm, I'm agreeing with them and, with that standpoint of it because like I'm not. Why the fuck would I do that? But and it's, then, but it's, to me, when they say that, it's like you can't even think like that because I've been fucking with this person. I understand that, but so even if you say that, I don't give a fuck because I've been fucking with this like, I've been fucking with you so somebody, somebody be like oh if you did some some foul shit and niggas be like if, if I see him stand next to him then I'm, I'm going to have this kind of thought process about you and I'm be like nigga fuck y'all opinion because I'm still going to stand next to my I'm not, I'm not my saying boy. that a nigga gotta but a nigga ain't never finna call me a, a bad bitch I think I'm a bad bitch and I'm finna do songs and rap off BBL Drizzy but if you've been doing that if I've been doing it then that's my thing. So he a bad I'm, bitch. I'm not going to, no, that's with one person's opinion. <laughs> he a my bad nigga. bitch. If it, just like when nigga said Baca got weird shit out here, I, I'm not going to stop, like Scoo said, I'm not going to stop fucking with Baca because I've been fucking with Baca. Bro. That's what Drake said. But I've been I'm fucking saying, with Baca, I'm saying, bro. but I'm saying from the so standpoint that if, Joe Budden talking if, from if is. Nigga, like, if you, that's what I said. If you Scoo did something fucked up, I'm not going to stop fucking with y'all because. I know y'all deeper than what the world know y'all. So the world can say whatever they w- want to say. Or the world can be like, you you a bad bitch, yada, yada, yada. But nigga, niggas got words for days. I- I'm just saying, I- I'm not doing Niggas called Jay-Z a tabo ho. Do you think he stopped doing jujitsu and shit? No, he kept doing that shit. You know what I can say to what you just said is... To what you just said is... Similar to remember when I told you because he low key just reposted it the other day. 
Nigga, we don't let what other people dictate what the fuck we gonna I mean, do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, I'm just we telling gonna you do what I would do. Fuck I'm not doing do. that. I'm not doing it. Niggas ain't finna go too crazy. Bro, regardless of how much we think Drake fuck with Sexy Red, we all know that Drake don't fuck with Sexy Red like that. We don't know that because we don't know him. Or we don't I was going to say, you, listen, this, listen, I was going to tell you, this is why I wanted you to listen to the thing that I sent you is because he getting a part of whatever she getting. That's what I'm saying. This is what, <laughs> this is what I'm about to say. That's why he's doing that. Drake don't fuck with Sexy Red like that. Drake he's fuck. Get, Drake I'm not going to say whether he fuck with her or her. Bro, listen, listen, not, listen, listen. I don't look, 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 know look, look, that for a fact. Hear, hear me out, hear me out. But what I listen, do on, really on, feel on. like is this nigga you is getting Drake, money from you. You Drake, you Drake. All the bitches you done had, all the shorties you can get, you gonna spend your time with Sexy Red. Yeah. Uh, but that's what I'm saying. I'm so saying the reason yes why because... you spending your time is yeah for one thing. This uh, again, I'm going. We going back. Now we going back to what they say. Future, Migos, Thug, Two Chains. He did the same thing to all of these niggas. It's the same play, except for he doing it with a female now because why? Because Sexy Red got an audience. And you don't think he got real relationships with Thug? You don't think he got real relationships with Two Chains? No. I mean, you look, look, look. All right. If these niggas didn't think they had, they still vouch for the nigga though. Two no, nobody didn't say I shit think, about that I shit, think, boy. I think uh, you don't think they. I think thug, initially thug, his. You don't, think, you don't think your boy Thug fuck with Drake? Listen, listen. I'm asking you. Do you think Thug fuck with Drake? Listen, listen. Yes, Thug fuck with Drake to a certain extent. Obviously, I, yeah. But what well, I'm what saying, saying to you is, is Drake don't really fuck with that. Yeah, or they don't fuck with each other. Like bro, Drake. Huncho just came out. I don't know how long when niggas start fucking with Huncho. Drake went to go wherever bro was at and took a picture with him and posted it. Bro didn't even post a picture. Only Drake did. Why? Because I got to let you know that I'm with these niggas. So, yeah, I fuck with these niggas to a certain extent. But no, I don't fuck with them niggas like that. But you think you think Thug fuck with Drake heavy? You think Thug fuck with Future more or Drake more? Drake. Oh, <laughs> wow. Well, I, 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 I don't. I can't. Yeah, I don't I, I, but that's just that's, <laughs> that's, that's just off an assumption because niggas. That's what I'm saying, nigga. We we can that's sit crazy. here and assume all day, but unless we can call them niggas and be like, "What's the real?" Then I we it's all gonna be allegations until we know. Listen, for, thug for sure. be with Future way more. Like this is documented. They from the same section. They be with the same people. That's this that's, is stuff that niggas done said it's all solid. the time. I'm just saying though. Again, I'm not. I'm not. Drake is a nigga that attaches himself to niggas when they going crazy. We know this already. So yeah, I understand why. Is that you, wrong? When you doing it for them reasons, like yeah, bro, you don't even you showing everybody love. Like you trying to act like you something that you not. You showing everybody love. You in this section. You you putting niggas on, bro. Thug was gonna be thug regardless. Without Drake or nothing. I didn't start listening to Thug because Drake, nigga. I didn't start listening to no nigga that we just mentioned because of Drake. But just like we had the discussion before. You, 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 bro. Bro, none of y'all <laughs> niggas did. What the fuck? You, you, Y'all bro. niggas didn't start listening. I'm not going to say, I can't say Drake specifically, like off the top of my head. Bro, y'all. But there are other artists that I started listening to because I heard them on somebody else. Yeah. Show. But I'm I'm talking about the niggas that we talking about. I don't give a fuck about none of these. We're, we talking about Drake. We're small samples to the world, though. Bro, bro so again. We didn't just hear when Thug and Drake start. When when was Thug and Drake first? What is Thug and Drake first song? Oh, I can't tell you exactly know. off the top of my head. I can't tell you. How long ago you think it was though? But a minute. But again, this one, the only thing I'm saying is, is this goes back to the discussion that we had about the damn song, which you agree, you disagree with because it was certain. Now I had to explain to you, you being from a certain area. In the region of the United States of America, you're gonna hear shit differently because you're from that. You got you got ties to that South. Us plain just Midwest niggas went and listened to South shit like that. It wasn't coming back to us fast enough. Like Boosie, niggas thought nigga for a long time. Niggas niggas still to right now. A lot of motherfuckers still call "Wipe Me Down" Boosie song. Like now to this day, still call "Wipe Me Down" Boosie song. Because that's the they feel like that's the first song Boosie came out with, and it was like, oh shit, this Boosie, and then set it off. Mm-hmm. And it was like, okay, this this Boosie, but niggas niggas who been listening to Boosie think that's one of his wackest songs, like or wackest verses on the 
wipe me down. But like that 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 flourish for motherfuckers. But when it come back to the even the Tony Montana I was telling you about, nigga, we heard Tony Montana. I I heard it differently because I heard it because I was a future fan before any of that shit. But most motherfuckers just just listen to music casually and heard it with when Drake finally got on it because that's when it blew up in the Mia West. Now niggas hearing it with Drake on it, so they like, oh shit. Or Drake on Amigo shit, or Drake on JB Black Boy shit. It's like, well, I'm saying all of these you know niggas is already established already. But ni- a lot of Do niggas think in the that, world don't be knowing that. Yeah, unless I mean, they listen he, to music. he might have opened up an audience for niggas the same thing they did for a Drake. Big audience. Do you think or the that same Drake, thing they did for Drake, bro? Do you Drake think Drake no connection with audience? Future or not Future with the came more from? Bird too, Birdman though, from Thug, of course, okay. nigga. And then I'm uh, so I mean I'm just saying that to the point of you saying like, do he really fuck with the that could have yeah, been yeah, that could have been just a label thing or industry thing where it's like okay you y'all this get makes together sense. yeah it makes sense for y'all to no, do no I'm this. saying but yeah you I'm saying the, all same the, way down tripping all the niggas, niggas attack, at a lower they, level they, the way down tripping little Lido got together but they just stay together Gotti was like hey y'all should y'all do should, music yeah. and then they end up but they real life cool though that's not the same thing but they I'm saying that can happen it can happen where hey we going into we, we this would to see just that do already. music. We would see that already. But now, okay, now we cool. It's been hella years, bro. We would have been seen that. We would have been seen that. No, I'm I'm saying, I'm not saying it to that relationship specifically. Oh, well, I'm yeah, just yeah. saying I mean, yeah, the yeah, way that, Drake's that doing happen. whatever he's doing. That nigga okay, don't we fuck going with into like this to do music. If but we I get see, cool, I we think, get cool. And if we don't, do, we don't. But I think they understand that they on they on they on two different they they like they two different paths. Like it's two different things. So we not gonna be in the same seats. Or the same rooms because we do, in in essence, we do two different things. Like we do music, but our crowds are completely different. But I still fuck with like Punch Fox. I I I would I, I would fuck with him. Like I would fuck with bro. But I know how I can just look at him and tell he's so eccentric that we are hanging in two different rooms. So we're not gonna be seen or be in the same places all the time. But. That doesn't take away how much I fuck with you, like with your music type shit. But bro, when when you know have saying? you kicked it with bro? I'm that's what I'm saying. I probably wouldn't because that's my whole thing. But that's that's my thing. That doesn't mean that I don't fuck with you though. I'm not saying that either. But you you don't kick it with him. But I ain't got to not kick with you to but fuck with you. Re, in reality, you, you got people that you cool with that you don't that you don't that kick you don't. it with. Listen, 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 listen. You don't kick it with this nigga at all. G. It's not uh, niggas that I don't see because it's been the love while. Wow. Like oh shit, John stay way in fucking wherever, so I gotta catch John when I catch him. Nigga, you don't never. We don't say we finna go kick it with bro. I'm saying, and what I'm saying is, is we're two different people, so I probably would never. But it's still people that I, my nigga Cody Brulette. We two different people. You ain't even never heard me talk about this nigga, but I go fight for this white boy. You know what I'm saying? But we live two different lives, and I don't kick it with him. But I'm telling you, you probably did at a time. We we see not like that. well I'm telling you bro it's never we never kicked it outside of me being in a certain place with him you see what I'm saying what it's you only mean? been What's conversations like we worked together for a little bit of time okay, okay. that's what I'm saying but what I'm saying is I've never kicked it with him outside that working spot but y'all built a y'all built but a, that go to the the music thing the that, music is the work the music listen, is listen, the work listen, so we build we build a relationship to the saying. point where I can fuck I know I fuck with you but our rooms are gonna be different rooms but that doesn't mean that I don't fuck with you to the point where the world may not see it as fuck with each other because they don't see us all the time together or see us in the, we ain't not from the same place but can't nobody tell me I don't fuck with you though but listen anybody can say that I, I didn't but say it's that. not true though that's what I'm saying I'm saying listen listen I never said that Drake don't fuck with these niggas. Obviously, he be with them. I said he don't fuck with them niggas like that. They don't fuck with Drake like that either. That's why they said they don't. Bro, the reason why, if 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 a nigga fucked with Future like that, for real, why would I make a song called Like That and then ask you, basically, is you like that throughout this whole song? Because I know that you not like that. I mean, you can have a fallout. Again, if we have a fallout, then I'm and telling future, you something that I know for a future fact. Future is then. very emotional. Bro, we all know this. Drake more... We we know. Look, 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 look. I, I never said that he's not. If he I have a nigga, fallout bro. with you, but, but and I make a song too. about you, how likely you think this song is? How like how true you think this song is? I'm about to make if I'm not fucking with you after we just came from being cool for this whole time. 
It could have some emphasis. A on lot it. of this shit probably got some truth in it. It could have some emphasis on it, but that every, don't change nothing. And the fact that we were we were cool. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, being, being cool, cool with somebody is being cool. With some, plenty of niggas more that y'all cool with. Cool. Yeah, we what, clearly what's more we, than we, cool? had, we made a whole ass album together. We clearly was more than cool. But nigga, that, that's y'all just said what that was for. Nigga, if him and Sexy Red make an album right now. It's a label movie. No, that's not the same thing. For, well, it's for, not. You just said that. You just no, said I said that. the sexy red thing is really like he damn, she damn near signed to this nigga. I'm saying, Future I'm, saying, is I'm not. saying how cool, how cool niggas. I, I, if I if I do this for you, we could get in the club. I get you in the club audience club scene. Boom, 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 boom. You you introduce me to this scene. Boom, 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 boom. Now we cross referenced our audience. It's the same shit. That don't mean we cool like that. Man, listen, man, I'm just not, I'm not making no fucking, I think Joe Budden, I think Joe Budden be saying some real shit. I think Drake be doing some, getting this shit sometime. Especially you see all the stories that come out about the nigga, about shit that he done did, the artists and shit. Which, like I said, I think every nigga do that really who, 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 uh. Nine times out of 10, you don't get that rich and not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think every nigga do that who, who do that. But unless you just invented something that's never been invented. And even in that case, that's still not true either. If you really look at the history of a lot of shit. Nick niggas then stole niggas whole ideas. I'm not kicking it with sexy red though like that. Like it's a thousand. He can go and do a song with Lotto. But he might not be able to. Well. It's Drake. He just did a song with a nigga and said, Wagwan Delilah. <laughs> Come on, bro. That's why you got to watch the thing that I said you. I'll watch it, though. You got to watch the whole thing. Watch it in one and a half speed so it can go by a little bit faster. I'll watch it. I just got to find one. Because I ain't going to lie to you. I do that with a lot of shit. <laughs> I'll, I'll be it. watching shit and I'll be like, I don't know if I can watch this whole thing. But I want to watch it. So I, I speed it up. That shit. I was looking at the uh, him talk about uh, and, and being a label executive, blah blah blah. How early he was doing all of that shit. That's another thing, man. Like niggas do music and they be like OD investing in that type of shit. Like I don't give a fuck about that shit, bro. I don't care about no fucking DJs like that. Like that's what it is. If you want to be successful, you want to be successful. I don't care about that shit. I just like to rap. I'm not even just saying in, in rap. I'm just saying no, I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm just saying, yeah, yeah, I'm saying for rap. I like rapping. I like the art of rap. I really don't care about goddamn. But sometimes in that, you got to find somebody that might be that's going to do that leg work for you. All the history. I mean, shit, they do it like they... You you tell me something, I'll forget it in a day. I know. <laughs> the subtle I know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Unless it's something that I That's really... why I had to been on his ass about this house shit. Making sure he doing what he need to do on that. Because at this point, nigga. Oh, yeah, we all know. This, is, this need to be done. Shout out to, to my done. nigga Meg. About to put me in the game. This need to be done quick. Why this time next year niggas need to be You know what I mean? Having a house warming. Moving on up to the east side. Happy Father's Day to all my homies out there. Yo. You know what I'm saying? Who holding it down. You know what I'm saying? Keep on pushing this shit, get hard. Keep on pushing, man. To my new daddies up Kane Daddies this year, that's the homies. You in for a whirlwind. Kari P, you in for a whirlwind, but it's a beautiful ride, brother. Enjoy it. Love it. Shout out to all the pops out there. My pops, Darius pops, nigga Scoop pops, you know how much love his pops. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, everybody, we here for a reason. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for them niggas. Good, bad, or ugly relationships. What'd you, you know say? What you know how much I love my pops? What'd you just say? You know how much you love your pops? Oh, okay. You know how much you love your pops, bro. So. Even that type of relationship. So even hearing you talk about that even make, give me a hope for 
<laughs> Take it easy. <laughs> Give me a different hope for me and my pops relationship, even though the, the fucked up shit that we went through. So it's be like, you know what I'm saying? And and I hate to start off the preface of like, oh yeah, Uncle Reggie's the one I look at, but it's just facts of the matter. I ain't never seen be that like that, that nigga. My uncle was, was my pops shit. was there. I still had another second father figure, so it ain't even it ain't that it ain't no different. So that's what that really was, but man, yeah, shout out to the niggas that be trying out, and it makes me understand now having my own and going through what they call life, nigga. It may help me understand like some of the. I ain't say some of the choices that was made, but it helps me understand some of the things that was done that may I, I may not have seen this like deemed right, but it was like, all right, nigga, I don't know what the situation was when you was going through this part of your life to make you choose this decision over choosing this decision. So I can't hold you to that because there's been things in my life where I was like, I chose this over this, and most people thought this was the right decision over this. So like, I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Niggas don't know, and it ain't a book, and especially for niggas who ain't had days, they ain't had the ropes, or ain't been showed the right way, or shit like that. So it get it get it get it get it get kind of tricky, get kind of difficult. But like, keep on pushing. Every day you wake up is a different day. You know what I'm saying? To as long create, as you here, you yeah, can. you can create your different. You can create something new. As long as you're trying. Like I told him, the one reason that made me fuck with my pops, cause nigga, even when I went reading them letters. Nigga, and he got so smart to the point where he was just putting "I love you" on on the envelopes. So I knew for a fact if if I ain't know nothing else, I knew that nigga Ernest loved me. Like, <laughs> if anything, so just make sure you know what I'm saying if y'all don't got a good relationship with yours or the BMs or the mothers of y'all child or the case may be, just make sure the kid know that they love you and shit. Keep on trying. It's gonna get it's gonna get better, even if it's not tough, even if not the best relationship right now. So yeah, it's a word of advice, man. So I done been through a lot of shit, nigga, up and downs with kids. You know what I'm saying? The mothers, but life, bro. Well, it's, it's hard to stretch yourself so amongst, so. amongst, mm-hmm. amongst so many. I was talking to this coach, and I don't feel like I'm rambling, but I was talking to this coach when I asked him coaches, and he was like, bro, I got, I got seven boys, four of them in different states. They four of them in different states, three of them here. So he's like, I understand what it is to be like, to not have that time and not have that balance to be like in all their lives doing everything that they can do and then doing everything they do or just spending that time. It was like, damn, hearing that gave me a, like, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? I, it, at first I thought it wasn't possible, but understanding that like shit, it's not possible really. Cause you only one person, and if you got motherfucking different kids in different states, different households, and shit like that, it, it, it get it get it get tricky and get hard. But nigga, keep on showing the love to them seeds, nigga, and un- un- make them understand that you love them, and keep on living, bro. For real, for real. Don't stress over that one thing. Just under, just make them understand that you love them to the best of your co- capability. For real, for real. That's all my niggas got multiple kids out here in the world. This for some Father's Day shit. It's a P.S. at the end. You feel me? But I'm done rambling though. That was just. All right, clap it up, clap it up. Me talking. Real shit. There was some OGs in the building today. How it was, how it started. The guys. So, what you're saying is. Pod. Bit. Go to YouTube. So, what you're saying is. Ring that subscribe. Ring that bell, ring that bell, ring that bell, subscribe, like if you on if you on IG, save them videos. Yeah, we need saves, comments. Save them videos on IG, comment, please. And uh, what's the other one? You feel me? You feel me? You feel me? You feel me? Share. And share. Everything I G share. <laughs> yeah, yeah, share. Like, Damn, what's the other one? <laughs> on YouTube, yeah. ring that bell, subscribe. On IG, oh. save them videos, share, 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 and share comment, save, and bro. comment. Share, save, comment for I G. You on the YouTube? You fucking with the YouTube? Make sure you, make sure you ringing that bell, so you can get all the videos, the whole videos. And make sure that you subscribing so we can understand that you fucking with us for real, for real. You hear me? Facebook, share them, save them. You can save them on Facebook too. You feel what I'm saying? And it's all free. It's just a couple clicks. You hear what I'm saying? That being said, we out this bitch.